Hey, everybody. We're here in the Giant Bomb Studios. We're here at, at Giant Bomb Studios. It's a whole building. Taking it over? We've yeah, we're taking wow. it over. A little bit by a little bit. I said Matt Rory, Brad Shoemaker. Uh, we're metastasizing. Yeah. How's it going? Not bad. Great. All right. We're here. We got these uh, Titanfall beta codes here. The, the, the beta is going to be running starting tomorrow widely and then kind of through the next uh, handful of days. And thought we'd fire it up and, and mess around with it for a little bit here. Uh, Vinny's going to be joining us in a little bit. He's has to download it, I guess. <laughs> There's a firm end date for this, like at the end of the weekend or something? Yeah. Okay. It's, well, it's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to start Friday and then I guess go through like Wednesday or mm. Thursday or something. It's pretty, pretty short. So uh, they already did beta signups. I think they're still taking beta signups on their site. Uh, now at this point, you got to figure this game is pretty close to go going gold. Like calling it a beta, it's probably more a yeah. stress test, really, for server yeah. stuff. Right? So yeah. I mean, this is kind of the first big <laughs> test for Microsoft's server infrastructure ah. as far as games go. Hmm. So they ran an alpha that they didn't. That yeah, was super that. limited. Uh, that was like before a, that weird like resolution textures, like twenty five percent. Yeah, or something. something like that. So, so. This, this is supposed to be the proper beta. Uh, this is this is basically <laughs> what I played when I was in LA. So cool. uh, it's not too far off from that. And I don't know. I've been playing it today, and I thought. I want to play some more of it, so uh, how about I invite you to this game and we play for America? Yep. I got the PC version here, too. We'll, we'll jump into that a little bit later. Oh, look at that guy playing Strider. Oh, it snapped. Let's play. Party. How do I? No. Oh, just B unsnaps. Right, there we go. Fucking snap. Ah. Thought that was a good idea. Okay, so I go to notifications, accept and play? Oh. Sure, yeah. They're, they're saying this stuff will be totally refreshed by the time this game comes out, right? Yeah. Sure. Is that the yeah, word? They're saying a lot of stuff. <laughs> uh, I hope they said that a, a firmware update was going to hit on like Tuesday of this week and it didn't make it yeah, out. So, sure. Uh, you know, they, they've got a couple of updates now between between now and, and the launch of the game. So uh, let's play. Uh, let's uh, do I need to do any loadout stuff? Or you should can't I just... yet. Okay. You're not high enough level to do okay. custom. Like it, it's it's the Call of Duty progression here. Okay. So you know, if I get into loadouts, I've got my custom pilots here that I can set up. But I still can't do Titans. I only have the the default, the default robots. The uh, but let me set up my burn cards real quick here before I jump in. Uh, let's take decisive action and prosthetic legs. Are these just basically perks? No, they are one-time use cards that you can use when you are respawning. Ah. Uh, and you earn them just by playing the game. Huh. Uh, so, you know, over the course of the match, you'll, you'll kind of see them unlock. One time per round? Do you, do you find yourself burning... One time per life. ...your burn uh, cards huh. uh, in every match? Yeah, I mean, you like... use them pretty, pretty in, consistently? In, in, from what I've seen so far, you seem to earn them relatively quickly, so no, I've, but I've I mean, not been shy about using them. Okay, so you find them pretty useful? Yeah. Let's go to hard point. Well, if they're, if they're one use for life, you, there's no... Is there a drawback for using them? No, no, it's it's one life. They're only active for one life. So if I get if I use prosthetic legs, if I activate it oh, when okay, I'm respawning so and then die, it's gone. Okay, I see. So, hi guys. Hi, Benny. Hi. hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. How's that? Is that coffee? You drink coffee? This is water. Water. Okay. I'm cooling this, down. You got this, a you got a coffee this, cup. Here. Come on, that's Finney's water cup. It's hot Titanfall coverage. Whoa. Oh. Caution, hot. <laughs> Caution. <laughs> It was pretty warm here today. It was like 67. It was. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've been sweating all day. Does that, does that mean you're getting sick? No, I think it means I'm caution hot. Oh, okay. All right. I've well, had a fever ever since that Dragon Ball Z. Oh, yeah. Well, that's, yeah, that. I don't know what the is, cure is, uh, you know? There is no cure for that horrific disease. For, for Battle of Z? Yeah. When you've, when you've contracted the Battle of Z. <laughs> well, we're not finding a match here, mm. which is great because I've been playing it all day, and I wonder if it's just broken because we're trying to match up together. That's probably right. Or because we're trying to stream it. Yeah, it's broken because we're It's live. waiting for a all teammate, right. I think. Okay, say. there it goes. Say. All right, connecting, connecting, connecting. There we go. There's some people. All right, three on three. <laughs> the fullest of games. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so I, I, I just unlocked burn cards. Um, and I think at level 10, you unlock the, the custom, custom robots. Mm. Customizable robots. I'm pretty hot uh, because Ooh. of the real mist quick look we did earlier. I think I caught something from it. Yeah. A virus or something. It's just, it looked. I like saw a, you guys playing that. It looked harder to play, like the free look. Mm, Didn't yeah. seem like now that you can look anywhere, that's not how that game was designed <laughs> right. at all. Yeah, it's supposed to be like this stuff is on hey, the screen look for a reason. Here, right. Look right here. Also, it's missed, so don't look at it at all. Also, what do you do? Yeah, that was one of the puzzles, right? Yeah. Like, why are you playing this? Yeah. <laughs> Puzzle number one is just 
do you really, are you sure you want to do this? What? It, oh, that's a long cooldown, tick down. Yeah, it, it's shorter if the match is full. Uh, I wonder, uh -oh. but I wonder, yeah, if it's because Brad is because oh, Brad is over level, level one or because of Brad, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, like everybody can't just ready up. Oh, well, we got you know, no, because it, it wants to try to fill the match. This is like a half full yeah, match, right? That makes here. sense. What, so, what's in this? What, it's in the beta. It's a selection of weapons. It's not all the weapons. So, if I go to challenges, uh, you got eight no, if I go to personal stats here, we can see uh, fifteen of sixteen weapons. Three of nine attachments, 20 mods. Titanfall, big data. Like, I like it. It's big data. It's big day Big ta. Exactly. Yeah, it's <laughs> definitely part of big data. Like do, the, do the guns feel like Call of Duty guns to you? Kind of. Since, you know, it's the future and they're not modeling real weapons anymore. Like, I mean, it's, <clears> it's a submachine gun, a shotgun, yeah. a sniper rifle. Okay. Like, they're, you know, they're like making the, regular guns. Okay. The smart pistol's kind of the one exception yeah, to yeah, that. Yeah. That's sure. got that lock on. Have you been... Uh, have you been keeping an eye out for any Call of Duty snipes in there? Anything weird? <laughs> any, any like soap billboards yeah. or, you know. With a bullet hole through it or, <laughs> yeah. uh, I haven't seen any of that. There's only two maps in the in this. Okay. They still haven't said how many maps are going to be in the full version of the game. Two maps. Yeah, there you go. That's, that's maybe that's why they haven't said anything. <laughs> well, th so the weird thing about this game is that the, it's co-op when you're playing the single player campaign, right? Or you're playing it, against people. It, yeah, it is all multiplayer. Yeah. There is there there is classic multiplayer, which is what's in the beta, and there's campaign multiplayer, which is going to have more kind of story hooks in it. But they haven't really showed that stuff. So <laughs> I'm going to use a burn card here, decisive action. It'll immediately shave 40 seconds off of my first Titan build okay. time. You got a robot. Who's that robot guy on the plane with you? He's a, like a concierge. His name's yeah. Fred. He's just like, hey man. You're, oh, so you have AI teammates here, I'm assuming. I yes, was you do. Once yes. Okay. Huh. Uh, a human like you, kill me. So they're they're just kind of drones, you know. They're they're grunts that. Do um, you get kills for killing enemy AI? Is that counted? Your... They're different kills. Do you get skills for kills? Skills for kills, <laughs> agent. <laughs> Sounds like a really weird '80s band. Uh, so primarily, you want to kill the other players, which are called pilots. But the grunts are also there uh, to kind of keep you on your toes. Yeah. Um, Oh. They're not, you know, yeah. they're not super tough. They, it seems like they have a single focus. <laughs> yeah, you know? they're a little focused on standing there yeah. and, you know, not running to gunfire when <laughs> they hear it in the next room over. If you catch them doing their thing, they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't focus. immediately. Yeah. But if you, you know, if you stand around, you'll get killed. You know, if you fuck up, they will eventually yeah. kill you. Not great multitaskers. No. <laughs> oh, That's why seat. they're grunts and not pilots, you know? You're totally. Look at this guy. I know one thing. It is walking backwards. Oh, that was actually a human, so. <laughs> Maybe that guy should be a grunt. Maybe that guy should be demoted from pilot to grunt. Have you noticed any weird microtransaction stuff in this? They have said that there are no microtransactions in the mm. game, which is kind of crazy because that burn card stuff yeah. looks like one yeah. big microtransaction. Do you think that something like it was a late design decision yeah. where like, do we put it in or not? I, we, maybe, do I don't we, know. We've got it in there. Nah. Help me take C. We got C. All right, we got Charlie. Oh, oh no. they're getting Charlie. I'm making my robot come. All right, hey, hey, hey. Wait, that came out yeah, wrong. That's, that's, oh. that's, that did not sound right at all. So what's the cooldown on a Titan from the beginning of a match? You I think it's four minutes. Yeah, it's and uh, as huh? you get kills, that uh, that number drops. So every every kill you get drops that number a little bit. Where'd that fucking guy go. Hey. All right. And so then. Now that you're in the robot, your kills are, are taking time off of your... Your damage core upgrade. So it's like a, oh man, I got a guy on me. I got a guy on me. Oh no! Get off my robot! Don't let up. Ooh, I got my big robot. Oh! Is he still oh, up no. there? Did I get him? Do you, do I got you him. damage your own robot? I don't, I don't, don't think so. But your robot's My robot's gonna fire. blow up. <laughs> you're on fire. Guys, tight and ready. My robot's done. I wish they said goodbye before they blew up. <laughs> like, Goodbye. Like Iron Giant. <laughs> oh, here comes my robot. <laughs> Just slow wave, sad wave. <laughs> oh, love you. Oh. oh no, that's big. What would you uh, name your robot, robot, man? 
Shogo. Yeah? No. Would he be part of the mobile armor division? Never particularly cared for Shogo myself. Oh, it was uh, a great idea, poorly executed. Yeah. Y you're right to not like Shogo. Shogo's not a good game, but it's... I like, it, it's, its heart was in such the right place, it's a though. Game. It should have been great. I like it when totally the guys wasn't. spin around when you shoot him in the shoulder. Or maybe anywhere. Hey, your type will be ready in 60 seconds. We just lost I'm hitting this big robot and I have nothing to shoot. I'm gonna start uh, sprinkling some uh, chat questions if you guys have sure, time for yeah. that. Uh, any, have you noticed any uh, penetration shooting through walls? I have not. Wings? Most of these walls look pretty solid. Yeah. Oh, that was something that they've been putting into more of the Call of Duties though over time, like weapon penetration, right? Yeah, uh, like perks yeah. Perks and stuff. And they would have been... a perk that just made it so you uh -oh. penetrated through more surfaces. Yeah. Um, I'd be curious if that big, that big uh, mech gun did anything like that. But... Have you noticed any oh, no. friendly fire or toggles for friendly fire? No. This there, is not really that kind of game. There is no friendly fire? You can't? No. Okay. Oh, God. What you might be able to damage a Titan or something like that. I, I don't know about that for certain, but... Sounds like something to try out. Find when Brad. It, <laughs> <laughs> when it says pilot locking, that means a pilot is locking yeah, yeah, his yeah, anti no, I, I know, I know that, but, but other than the four-way directional thing, that's all the indication you have about where they are, right? Yeah. God, that's, that's kind of devious. Like... As soon as I see that, I frantically start Shit. looking at all the windows and stuff, trying to figure yeah. out where they are. Is this 720p? 10 uh, this 80? is set to 720p like a, okay. on the Xbox side. Sounds like the actual game is a little above 720p, but not much. Stop sh shooting me. It's contested, but where's the other? There he is. Die! Have people already dissected that? Like, run it through their yeah. Yeah. frame buffers? and. Uh, it's just a pixel counter thing. There's a bunch of big robots over here. Do you feel like we'd live in a better world if that didn't exist? What? Pixel counting? Eh, I don't know. Like, there's always going to be a segment of people that like that that matters to, of course. and that's fine. But it's not the only thing, you know. Man, this anti-Titan rocket launcher is pretty great. I yeah, just... it, they they do a lot no! of damage. Oh, oh, I died. I'm gonna turn on my prosthetic legs. Oh, wow. And then you can turn them off later. Yeah. Look at how fast I'm going. And I have a speed boost perk, so I'm just gonna hit it and just fucking Whoa, 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 ass. whoa. Something bad was happening on your screen. Oh, I got, I walked into that guy's foot. That was actually That's, a mistake. He was eating that other man. Uh, if I see a guy m mantling and wall running and stuff, is he guaranteed to be a player? Yes. I thought I think so. You don't, you oh, don't, you got pounded. You don't see bots doing stuff like no, that. I have not seen a lot of that. So, uh, Call of Duty with Max, is that an accurate assessment? I mean, kind of. Like, you know, you look at the menus and, and how they're doing handling the progression and stuff like that. Like, they're oh, definitely boy. making that kind of game. Um, yeah, the menus look very similar. Yeah. You know, I, I, mean, bet, I bet you can prestige in this game. It has the equivalent yeah. of perks, you know? Boom. Oh. Um, now with these Titan kills, I, I notice you guys popping out before it blows up. Is that often what happens, or is there a way to kill a pilot inside the mech too? Or? Uh, so they, when you are they gonna get really mad at me if I call them mechs? Uh, who cares? Um, they're mechs. <laughs> um, when you reduce their health, uh, a, a, a suit's health down to zero. It enters a doomed state, yeah. uh, where it starts to kind of bleed out, basically, uh, and that's when you want to eject. But if, if it's in a doomed state and you are in a robot and you run up to it and melee it, you will rip the pilot out and crush him. Hmm. Otherwise, they will almost always uh, pop out and eject. One of the perks actually is auto eject. Oh, you're a man down. That's why. Uh, do you have to be on the ground to get into your mech, or can no. you do it from the air? Any angle. All right. And you can you can set your mech to guard or follow, but can you summon it? Uh, if it's in follow, it will it will follow It'll you. Try and so get that it's kind of always possible. being summoned. Okay, but you can't set like a point on the ground. And no, okay. you can set a point on the ground when you're calling it in. Is there any connect uh, integration like voice commands or anything? I don't think so. Yeah. Oh man, what if the connect let you whistle and like your mech showed up and like, <laughs> or no, you jump out the window and then like land on it, like oh, your horse going backwards, firing yeah. up the window. That'd be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. You can take that one for free. I've been focusing more on shooting dudes than hey, capturing points, and we are totally losing. Oh, well, you're also a man down, I think. Oh. Uh, I'm capturing a point. Hey, man, this is not looking good. Are you, you on A? Who, even, yeah, uh, I'm almost there. Even as a uh, human, you seem to take more damage than I remember in, like, a Call of Duty. 
You last yeah, like a little a bit, a little bit, or something like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. Running up these walls. Also, oh no! <laughs> oh god, there is a large robot outside that window. Just fuck now. tied. That couldn't. Also, a lot of questions about the uh, controller firmware thing that they've been talking about. Yeah, something? so that hasn't gone out yet, but if you, I don't know. The games felt pretty fine to me. Um, I'm not 100% sure what that's updating. If it's like... Just Dead Zone or something? Yeah, if it's like Dead Zone or... or I, I didn't read the, the stuff that had, that had come out about that, but I was told the game would be twitchier until that uh, firmware update hits, and it's been pretty much fine. Oh, man. Uh, man. Do I get a respawn? Okay, I do. So... We lost, we need to evacuate. We have one life now, now that the, the epilogue has started. Oh, shit. Yeah, okay. So I'm out. What kind of mech custom, have you, so you, you haven't unlocked mech customization for your loadouts yet. Right, not yet. Do you yet. know what you can do in that kind of thing? It's, uh, it's primarily weapons. The, yeah. the beta only has this one oh, no. chassis in it, and it's kind of the, the medium chassis, basically. You know, oh, yeah. there's, like there's the Strider, which is Hell faster yeah. and lighter, and there's one that's heavier and, and slower. Uh, but those are not not oh. here for default unlocking type stuff. Fuck. Um, as far as I can tell. If you want to kill a human player on the ground, can you just walk over him? Yep. Match? Okay, there's no act. You don't yep. have to punch no. or kick. So what is this dropship thing? So the dropship comes after about 40 seconds, and then you basically the, the losing team has to evacuate. Ah. What happens if you they blow it up or you don't get on it? Then you don't get the points you would get for, for successfully evacuating. That's, it's oh. just sort of a little bonus huh. at the end. Neat. All right, we filled up at least, so it's a, it's a full match now. Have they showed you the 360 Ooh. version at, at all? No. No? Ooh. They're nope. being pretty secretive about that? Yeah, I know they, they delayed it like a few weeks, right? They did. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, when I was in L.A. to play this... I asked a handful of questions about the 360 version to both Respawn and EA, and they both just kind of went like, yeah, we're not really talking about that right now. So hmm. uh, That's weird. And then a couple days later, they pushed it back. So, What a PS4 version. How's that doing? It runs great. <laughs> yeah. Really good on PS4. That's a full 1080. Yeah. yeah. So what are, these are challenges? Yeah, so these are challenges, you know, like a Call of Duty, for example. Sure. Um, yeah, it's stuff like, you know, kill grunts with the submachine gun, you know. And and the attachments for the guns are unlocked that way, too. So uh, if I go into pilot loadout here and we were using this submachine gun, you can see I can unlock an HCOG because apparently uh, ACOGs are no longer cool no, in the future. We've moved down the alphabet. Uh, yeah. Um, and if I kill 100 grunts with this gun, I'll unlock that, that HCOG. Wow, really? And then there's these mods, too. Uh, but I haven't even unlocked... <clears throat> this stuff yet, I guess. I've been out of the Call of Duty loop for a while. Has that made it into Call of Duty, like weapon-specific upgrades, like Battlefield style? It's come and go. Okay. It, 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 yeah, it, it'll come and go depending on who how they it? feel. Yeah, but depending on who made it and how they feel like building the progression that year. Okay. Like there's been weapon levels in Modern Warfare uh, where each weapon can level up a and bunch get of like different attachments. And, and yeah, can I, can yeah. I change my loadout mid-match? Yes. Okay. Uh, you can hit start when you are uh, alive okay. and hit change loadout and cool. next time you spawn it'll be different. Is that the ascent of the loadouts? The pilot, uh, CQB, assault, and rifleman? Like the, of the defaults, yeah. yeah. Then you unlock three custom slots after huh. that. <gasps> and a couple of other weapons, like there's a sniper rifle and a submachine gun, which is what I'm using. Yeah, so far it doesn't seem so much like a close quarters Kind yeah, of game. Yeah. Like mid, oh, so mid. Yeah, kind of mid range to, you know, it's not quite Battlefield. Yeah. Um, but the, the maps, these maps at least, seem larger. And I don't know, there's been a lot of people complaining about the, you know, the player count, but. Like it's too low? Yeah. But the, these matches feel pretty action packed. Mm -hmm. Like I don't yeah. feel like. Six on six is still, that's set for PC, Xbox One, right? Yep. Yeah, so. yeah. I mean, that's, that's how they're building the game. But, you know, like. If you think about it in terms of it's six on six, but what if all 12 players had called their Titans down and were not in them? Yeah. Um, which would never happen, but it's what they at least have to account for in some weird way. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I, it, it's... It seems more like a design decision than anything else, and, and the these maps 
feel fine with that player count. You know, it's, it's been a while since I remember the backstory to this game. Like something happened to Earth, and you're all I don't, trying to I don't know that if we know we what it is. A robot. <laughs> you, you hang out with robots. Um, it's apparently party time. It's always party time. Oh. Nice. Oh. Are the mechs gonna have two or more people in them? No, uh, you can oh. you can ride on another mech. Oh yeah. Even a friendly. Shit. And no mech comboing, huh? Bravo. No devastator. No, no devastator. Fuck. Damn it. No gestalts. Man. Well, you gotta save something, right? Sure. Yeah. I mean, you know, gotta have a sequel someday. Ah, man, that guy was cloaked. Cloaks are always really, what, what is the drawback of the cloak? You can't move very fast or drains energy or something? Uh, it doesn't last very long. I mean, you know, right now I have a st uh, stim equipped, which is a speed boost and health regen boost. Yeah, and doing drugs, huh? Yeah. Better than them cloak drugs. Oh, wow. That's that guy a, had a shotgun. That's, a, that's close quarters. Oh, and he, hit, so that was a burn card weapon also. Uh, it is a, an amped version of the weapon, so. It more, probably is way more, damage, more savage lower, or something. Lower reload or something like that? Probably something like that. So you're saying cloak is a drug? Cloak? Oh, yeah. You actually, yeah, you take the drugs and turn invisible. <laughs> and think people can't see you? Yeah. But they actually can't see me, man. <laughs> now, this is the first Source Engine game since, what, like Portal 2 <clears throat> or something like that? Uh, yeah, but uh, I mean... I mean, Does it feel sourcey? I mean, no, so, like, no, I, not really. Yeah. I talked they to... Have. At E3 last year, I had talked to them about that stuff. Like, they said they have rewritten practically every part of the Source Engine at this point. Yeah, like, the reason... The reason they licensed it was that they were a startup and they needed to get ready to, or they needed to like start prototyping gameplay ideas sure, really fast. Right. So that let them get going quickly, oh, but, they've, <clears throat> but they've replaced most of the components huh. since, since they started. It sounds like they're about 90 people. Can you shoot while riding a friendly mech? Or I just... think so. It sounds like something you I have not to. tried that. Shotgun sounds like you got something to try. Uh, I'm just gonna run away and capture this point. Can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? What is the goal here for this uh, mission? This is uh, like just domination, so control capture. point capture. Ooh. Is this guy following me? Is he still <coughs> following me? Is he still following me? You're right, Vinny. This is not a close quarters game. It feels like. It doesn't seem like, like it. I've been I've been rolling with the shotgun and I'm not getting a lot of luck with it. Do you? Uh, can you duck? Yeah. Okay. Can you slide? Give me that robot. Uh, uh, I don't know if you can slide. Let's find out. Bravo is under no, you just duck. Okay. So apparently if you hit jump when you hit the ground, you will retain forward momentum. Have you tried that? Huh. No. Yeah, there you go. Jump off, Bravo. Too busy blowing up robots. Yeah. That looks like a really heavy cannon to shoot. That giant, uh... Like a, what is that, a javelin or something? Looks extremely heavy. So like, how do you, how do, you do the, your back. the the Titan shield left bumper? Oh, well done. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hold on, left bumper. Do you notice them do this, doing this kind of thing where they put the, uh, oh the hard points inside buildings that mechs can't get? Yeah. In? So the point C on this map, you can get in there with a mech, but the other ones you cannot. Did that Titan just pull me out of my? What? Yeah. Yes. Holy yeah. shit! <laughs> how do you do that? Uh, if you are all, if your Titan is in doom state and oh. they punch you, okay. I think it does that. Oh. I think that's how it works. I've only, only done it once. Can you go prone? These are the kind of questions I'm getting. No. A lot of Call of Duty fans in this, in this chat, I think. Can your Titan duck? Yes. It can? Yeah. <laughs> oh man, I'm not doing weird, so right? Yeah, that's a little weird. But uh, okay. Oh. I need to back off, let my shield up, uh, recharge. Oh, die, die. Nice. What happens if you're standing in the zone where the Titan's gonna drop? You're gonna, does it blow you up? Or I, I think it might. You might be able to. Oh come on! All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> I got. Should probably get away. I should probably get out of here. Did you close the hatch before leaving? I'm not sure what I. Oh! I just jumped off the world. Points, control points, right. Can you hold two guns at one time? Uh, yeah, well, it's three guns. You have your primary, I mean, your... At the same time. Oh, uh, 
none of the perks I or anything I've seen has been like akimbo type stuff. I'm not sure. That, that might be one of the upgrades. Have you noticed any but difference seen it. between factions? Like when you start, have you yeah. like? I mean, it's different people that show up in the corner of the screen. It's like the militia versus some mining corporation. This is the militia side. Okay. Does one seem to more evil than the other? No, they haven't. Well, that guy's named Spectre, so I'm assuming he's a bad guy. The Spectre is a, is a, is a type of um, a grunt. It's like an upgraded ah. grunt. Do the AI people get into mechs at all, or is that exclusively a pilot no, that's, that's, no. You gotta earn that. Yeah, the, the grunts are grunts, and the humans are pilots. Oh no. Oh you, man. Uh, Hey, you got, Two on one. You, you guys are tight and ready for deployment? You find a grunt and squish him with it? Can you deploy on it? Uh, how about I just try to deploy on myself? Okay. You got it. Stand by for tight. Here we go. It's coming! Okay. Okay. Nah, that's... Wait. I would, I would like to see you get squashed by that. Yeah. Uh, does regular gunfire hurt uh, Titans? I think it does a little bit. Just a little bit? Yeah. I'm pretty sure I remember when we played at E3 deploying a titan on somebody else's titan and it destroyed it huh it was uh and it was not uh it was not intentional let's see if i can <laughs> rip this guy out yeah there we go take yeah. it say hi hey what's hi. up later uh, it's too that, that seems like a good opportunity for something a little more gory uh, yeah uh, just like eh. is this rated t or i don't see a lot of blood at all i'd like to see him squash him the yeah uh, all right fun. I don't want to get that in your ears. After stuff. this, let's back out of control point and go, just go into regular like team deathmatch because I'm too focused on shooting dudes right now. It's just not. It's just not happening. What is the uh, so when the uh, opposing mech uses that that magnetic thing? What's the the option you have there? It's just don't fire for a yeah, second. Yeah, just don't shoot. Yeah, there's no way to like curve a bullet. Well, around you can it. you can run up there and melee. Oh yeah. Holy oh, shit! I launch a grenade into it and just blow his hand up. Yeah, maybe. I saw it in a movie one. Uh, Cars 2 has a similar skin. I believe so. Yeah. It's a hell of a gun. You're just getting points like Madman. I, I, I like it. I like seeing all the little things that you do yeah. to get points. It's, it's, it's fun. This whole war just stresses me out. It seems so expensive. Yeah, just robots falling out of the sky constantly. Constantly blowing up. I need another one! <laughs> oh. I feel like this does set up a great universe, though, to be like, you know what I'm gonna play? The two ships that are in space firing the mechs, <laughs> like, just have, like, commander mode. Yeah, naval battles up there. Of, like, you think it's shitty down there? You should see what's happening up here. That'd be the EVE Online component of this yeah. universe. To, like, to come back, like, yeah, I lost $10,000 like, to your world last night. Just, like, dudes, like, mining Vespian gas up there so they can make enough Titans to, <laughs> to launch down here. Ultimately, it's an economic war. Need more ISK. Have you noticed anything really, really uh, ah. off-putting about this yet, Jeff? There's somebody who's asking if you noticed any major issues that you have with it. Not really. Oh no. Oh. I've got, I had a guy on my. Apparently, I had a guy on my thing. Yeah, now it's rated on. How is this thing still alive? It's in Doom State. Okay. Oh, okay. Just give it to, or you run up and punch it, or just give it time. Just get away from it. Oh my God. Are there any cryo weapons? Not that I've seen. Rail guns? Any rail guns? Sniper rifle. Uh, uh, but. No shattering max. Oh, that would be pretty cool. Oh man. All right. Not gonna get in that. Oh, they're taking Charlie. You should have a thing where it's like a decoy. Uh, I, I feel like at some point you probably recognize somebody else calling it a mech, right? You see the bubble and it happens. You should have ones that just come down with a nuke inside them. Yeah. That just explode. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Ugh. Get on that roof. Oh, I might not be able to get on that one. 
Oh, they're gonna win. It's close. Is it 400? Ah, uh, they're they're winning one point. <clears throat> he doesn't sound too bummed. Yeah. So yeah. Know, whatever. Lost this one today. Epilogue. A little highfalutin. You're highfalutin. If you're taking their get to the dropship a little too precious and a little too seriously. <laughs> Seems like Sprint is unlimited. It is. Here's what happened after the battle. We got to a dropship. Ah! I don't know how to get up there. Ruds went off. To go I don't to know how to get up there. Get, up, get yeah. outside and run up the wall. It's, it's a two-story building. We'll go in the oh, basement. Oh man! And find oh, a way there's up. Titans everywhere. Duh. Everyone is blowing up. Uh, anybody to repair mechs when they're in a doom state or anything like that? Don't think so. I haven't seen any sort of health regen on the the robots. I saw you try, Jeff. You tried to summon a mech or a Titan on a building. It does not happen. It does not happen. Yeah. They go to like the nearest available yeah, space. Yeah. Whoa, those guys are kicking each other. Uh, They're little, jump kicking each back other. Kick it's like a spin too. kick. Can a teammate of yours get on a Titan that you summon, or is it locked to you? Uh, they can't get in it. I think they can jump on it. Hmm. Well, they can definitely jump on it, but Sir Mixlot style. Um, yeah, let's play the other mode. Okay, so now I can do custom, custom max here. Leave with party. All right. What do you think the long-term business strategy is for this game? Do you think they're going to start doing it like uh, putting it right up against Call of Duty in 2015 yeah, or something like that? I or wonder. Kind of a... Like November? Yeah, I mean, it seems like this is a, a big thing for EA. Uh, yeah. I'm curious. February... You know, it could be off years with Battlefield because they're probably not going to oh, yeah. do Medal of Honor anymore. Yeah, I, would, I um, hope not. Although, you know what I do? I did like about Warfighter was the, the two-person gun team was thing. Idea. That was yeah. a neat idea. But uh, I'm, I'm curious why no, nobody else is... a. Army of Two? Soul in that yet. Well, the, in Warfighter, nobody played Warfighter, so we're probably not sure what I'm talking about, but every time you spawned in the multiplayer, you had a two-person team with somebody else. It would match you up automatically with somebody. Uh, and you could spawn on them, and uh, and they you could kind of, I forget what the other functionality, but mostly just spawning on them and, and protecting each other was was kind of a really good enforced team play <laughs> rank. in a big, uh, even in deathmatch kind of stuff. It was right. good. So I'm going to take pull rank because that's, that 80, that's 80 seconds. Who's that joker? Hey. He's some knucklehead. So, hey. Robert Barker Troop. Who are these quotes? Hi. I'll take uh, the implant, I guess. Have you noticed anything like UAVs? No, the only like kind of kill streaky type stuff is everything you kill takes time off you building your next ah. Titan or time off the damage core. And then the. The damage core thing, I think, is attached to the chassis of the mech you're using, mm -hmm. I think. Or it might be something you can customize. Um, all right, let's let's uh, let's play Attrition. You guys should try and summon mechs on the same slot. Mech and see what happens. All right. Two mechs cannot <coughs> exist in the same, in the same space, space. In the same yeah. point in time. I wonder if it even let you. I wonder if it like if it would just put it would intelligently yeah, yeah. like move it over. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Ready up. Uh, let's see here. So you earned those burn cards, right? You can you get yeah. Them you'll you you'll see them as part of like the Alex. The, Alex is playing. Yeah. Where is Alex? I just passed him to the left. Oh wait, where did he go? There he is. Oh, yeah, there he is. I forgot his name. It was Giancarlo. <laughs> yeah. Snap. Good question. Uh, where are the mechs with swords? That's it's Japan. Yeah. That's they're, cool. Yeah, they're fighting off in the Narita airport. I wonder if it'll get him in here now that we've already started matching. I would hope so. The teams aren't even. Oh. Not necessarily. Hurry, 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 hurry. It, it, it may not be able to. <clears throat> we may have to quit out and re restart the matchmaking. That's how a lot of games like this work. Oh. We, did, we didn't get them. We're going to leave. <laughs> there you go. Kessler. 
Kessler. <clears throat> Wait, I don't know if he's allowed to play with us. Yeah. He's probably in trouble just for... Just for having an Xbox <laughs> in the building. Yeah. It's like 4 o'clock. Yeah. Oh. yeah. <laughs> All right. He's doing research. Oh, okay. What do you think Sony's doing? I don't know. All right, while we wait for Alex, let's... Uh... Any fall damage? What? Any fall damage? I don't think... Oh, Matt fall Rory, no, no fall damage. Yeah. You like punch out what? of those mechs and they go flying up in the air. Finally, and... puberty arrives. <laughs> yeah, it's it's going to be a hell of a year, buddy. Oh. It's going to be a big year for everybody, <laughs> especially you guys. You're going to have to deal with me. <laughs> My shitty attitude. Yeah, so you see there it says core ability of the Atlas is damage core. So it seems like the different suits. What does damage core mean? That's, um, it's like a quad damage or double ah. damage or something like that. You just said quad damage. I know that. I know, right? Everybody All right. knows quad damage. There we got Alex. So. It's still one of my favorite sound effects in a video game. Quake 1. Get wow. quad damage. Wow. Yep. That's why Quake 1's the best game ever made. And uh, just so people know, we are going to try and play the PC game a little bit. Today. Yeah, yeah, I got it back there. Whoa. I just crashed. Wow. Cool. Out, out Plus, Kaiser Connect is unplugged. You gotta. What are you doing over here? Yeah. Cool. We'll play it. We'll play a mat. Well, we'll see if we. we go, let's, let's go watch can the you gravity. See if you can invite me again, maybe? Yeah. Am I, is that I'm out? Guessing I'm not still in your party. Did you get a visible invite there? Nope. I did not. You have them turned off? Nope. Worked last time. What are all these robots in the uh, in the loading screen here? They're robots. Grunts? Uh, the, the big red-eyed thing? Apparently I was still in your party. Huh. Apparently I have rejoined your party. Well, you know. Looks like I'm loading in. Maybe I'll make it. <laughs> you got, like, minute and a half. Yeah. Damn. Well, it might fill those slots. I think Joey Swear Words is a really good name. Yeah. <laughs> For the record. Hmm. DJ Shop Sticks is... That's pretty good, too. There. You're in. Cool. Grunts, I'm assuming, do less damage than other pilots. Do, do they? Do they not? They're just not as aggressive. Like yeah. they're, they're not very smart. So, they're just kind of something you shoot when there's no other pilots around. Yeah, and you can kind of farm them a little bit to, yeah. you know, get seconds off your next robot. So, so Brad, like as you're running from one control point to the next, you kind of have something to do as you're going. Another opportunity for Brad to feed. Yeah. What? I don't know what you're talking just about. Kid Brad, love you. How many uh, burn cards do you have, Brad? At level two? What are you, level two? Uh, you don't, you don't get them until level eight. Huh. So. Boy, they need to have just a ready up. Everybody go. It's well, a long time. They can't do that it in wasn't full, ranked right? matchmaking games because then people would rush it when they have an advantage and mm. screw it all up. Yeah, but then couldn't the disadvantaged, the disadvantaged folks not ready up? I, I guess. That's what I would do. I broke. I just broke through all the. But design as soon barriers. as the game is full, it yeah, starts. Right. So there's no point in. They just want a full game. Yeah. Fair enough. Ow. Martial law in Angel City. Massive walls were built to divide the city into many smaller districts. Oddly enough, that makes the uh, the load times and map size proper <laughs> for how it fits on a. Weird how that works. Disc. Now this is, this beta is not completely out there. Quite yet, right? No, tomorrow it seems like when is when the keys will start going out from, like the they're still taking applications on their site uh, for that stuff. So, oh, I should have used a burn card. I don't, I don't want to sound shitty or or mean to a game that's not out yet, but when we were playing this right before the stream came on, I I, I made the comment that it doesn't look, it looks good. It looks is it's is 30 FPS though, right? No, it's 60. Is it yeah, 60? 60? For the most part. Hmm. Yeah, there's a couple of things <clears> here and It's there. a little spotty, but... Just graphically, it doesn't, like, super, super pop out as something, like, true next gen. I thought you said you didn't want to be mean. I, I'm, I'm not trying to be mean. It looks really good, but it's just kind of a, you know... I don't know. I hear you. Yeah, like, yeah, it looks I, I nice, weird. but not, like, uh... I like the way it looks, though. 
Like, for next gen or not. I like, sure. I, I like the robot designs. Oh, those designs. are cool. And like the guns and stuff. Uh, I think I was telling Brad, it's, it looks like uh, District uh, 9. District 9. Uh, it looks like you're fighting. Yeah, uh, I think it looks movie. more like District 11, to be honest. Yeah. I'm just curious when they actually do show off the 360 well, version, if people are going to be surprised at how they... Like, the, it's not as big a gap as people would think between two versions. Yeah, I wonder. So, so would you, you think the, the bigger story is they look the same, or the 360 version looks worse than this? I think the bigger story would be if they looked pretty similar. If they look similar? Yeah, I mean, I'm not, I, I'm, I've am not. i never seen it, but I'm just kind of curious. Oh! Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Uh, uh, what's that? Green room's over in the, uh, by the, on the other side of the server room, I think is what you're looking for. Yeah, sorry. There's another studio over there. Yeah. Hope Somebody, she finds it. I don't know what the green room is. Yeah. I'm assuming that's the, uh... Somebody must have had a bad day. <laughs> Someone spilled something. So, somebody just came through looking to see... Oh, we'll think about that. Whoa! So somebody pointed out the alpha did have a texture issue where they were really small. Is the beta the same deal or? Don't know. We don't know? Nope. Huh. Well, it's 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 the, not that they were small, it's that it was like 25% the texture resolution of the, of yeah, the final game. Yeah, keep the download small, right? Yeah, uh, that's my understanding. But how, do you know how big these I think these textures are? look all right. I haven't yeah. looked to see what the install size is okay. yet. Maybe that's the issue then, I'm not, um, I'm not sure. It's not an issue by any, by any means, I don't mean to be rude. No, nah, it's... Then don't be rude, Matt. Maria. Rude. I thought we covered this. Yeah, seriously. I can be honest. Uh, I don't know. The, the, uh, some of the textures I think look fine. There are a couple that I thought looked kind of grungy. When you're on foot, health works exactly like Call of Duty, right? Yep. Okay. Oh man, spawn as Titan. Yes. How did you spawn as a titan? I, think. Uh, I had it. I, I had it ready when I died. Ah, interesting. On your HUD as a titan, what are those two little bars right below the middle of the screen? Uh, uh the the bar center uh, is your XP. I mean, there's two little white icons right above your. Oh, that's point. your dash. That's dash, how many dashes you have. Oh shit. Oh shit. And that recharges. Reload that gun, robot. Whoa. Oh, there's some stuff happening. Yes, you're gonna, you're gonna hit. Uh, wow. Oh, wow, okay. I've been using the loadout that makes you auto-eject when you're doomed. Yeah. Oh, and, and I, <laughs> I did not process the cue that I should be ejecting. Any, uh, any way to change, uh, bot? Difficulty or AI settings or anything like that? No. Uh, maybe that'll be something that is playlist specific or something. Yeah. If they do like hardcore AI or something, Ooh. but um, but no. Go to your ow. Wait, wait, that's a guy. I haven't seen any grenades used at all here. Are there flashbangs or anything like that? You can just. Uh, there are two types of grenades. There are grenade grenades and oh, grenade mag grenades. grenades that do more damage to machines, uh, I guess. Such as a mech. Yeah, like a mech. Or maybe a specter, those, those might be machines, I don't know. Maybe those guys count as robots. I just died to an arc grenade. That, is that, I is think that that's the regular? The yeah, that's the regular kind of grenade, oh, I think. Okay. So I saw you got 30 points for a specter kill. You get 100 for a pilot kill, correct? Wait, I could have hacked that guy. Was there some kind of prompt or something? I wonder if I can turn. Oh, oh dear said? lord. What How just happened? There? Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. What's going on? Shoot him, shoot him in the back, shoot it. How did, how did this happen? Yeah, no, like, not oh that. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> I don't know how I got on top of this guy, but. I would pay good money to see you. You just that. land on him. You gotta just jump oh. at him and it'll eventually happen. Well. Wow. Oops, shit. Do you, do you think this is uh, the next big thing for FPS? Like, uh... I think it's a lot of fun. Yeah. Like, you know, whether it catches on or not, there's so many, just, just so much weird business shit with it only being on the Xbox. Uh, and you know how many Xbox Ones are out there, and yeah. how, how are they marketing it, and all not, that stuff. Also, like, not being on Steam. Right. Yeah. Um, I think this this beta is really fun. I hope the full game is good like this is. But in terms of, is it going to be some huge success? Like maybe. 
well, we're done as someone here. who's like gotten really tired of Call of Duty, this feels different enough to where I'm I'm pretty into it. Do you think this will be attractive for people who are still way into Call of Duty? I don't know. Well, they're definitely going for the same audience. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh. Shit. Ugh. Ah! Man, I'm getting ripped up. So when you reload, you lose uh, the rest of the ammo in that magazine? I, I'm not sure. It, it's that's the impression I got, but someone. Someone said, no, that's not the case, but I don't know if they'd actually played it or not, so I've, I haven't done the, the math on it, but... Oh, who is shooting me? You! I'm just emptying yeah. magazines into this. Yeah. Yay! It seems like a bit of a design flaw to have this easily openable thing on the head that you can just shoot into and blow up a mech. Yeah. Where would you put it? I would put a, a padlock on that. Oh, just man. Just, just a little padlock. <laughs> that was close. And if you wanted to open it up, that you had to guess the combination. Oh, get up there. Oh, man, I'm really screwing up these jumps. Get on that building. It almost seems like getting to the, uh, <clears throat> the evac point early is a bad idea. Yeah, because yeah, well, everybody is going to converge there. But they don't respawn either at this at this point. Yeah. So if you can kind of take them out once you're there, then That's true. you know you're going to at least take care of business. Nine seconds. This would be a good time to use cloak if you have it. Ha! Huh. Like, get there and cloak. Or Call your titans then. Call uh, Brad. Do you have a titan? Calm oh, down. Shit. Defend it. Right on top of this building. I don't think you can do that. No, I got it in three seconds. I called mine down. Yeah. Oh, no, no! Get shot. I went over to the edge of the building to call down my titan and fucking guy killed I made it. Me. I got in. I got in. Nice. Oh. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Leave no titan behind. That's right. No one else. Just me. Later. Soul survivor. Damn it. It's a video it's game. Like it is. Yeah. Definitely a video game. Yeah. It's fun. It feels really good. Yeah. It does. So this is the replacement for that big old barrage of missiles uh, that you can fire as a Titan is this mm. lock-on heavy missile. Let's, uh, let's equip that on one of these other loadouts, I guess. Primary weapon, let's go quad rocket, why not? Uh, tactical, just the shield, slaved warheads, nuclear ejection, and auto eject, because I always forget. What's survivor? Uh, survivor is when you're in doom state, uh, you're, you tick down slower. Oh. More slowly, how about that? Mm. Are there different tiers of uh, of cards? Have you seen like? I don't know. It's like there are different this, colors on them. Like yeah, this, they seem to have so different on different icons. Like so these are all weapons. Are this color is all yeah. weapons. These are. But you haven't you haven't seen any kind of like, you know, rare or like. No. I could have sworn you had more before different options. Are you? Do you think eventually everybody have all the burn cards? They're one time use, so you can have multiples of oh, the same one up huh. here. Oh, you mean one time use permanently? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I didn't know that. <clears throat> Not a lot of voice chat happening. I have this plugged in, so we can't hear it. Well, uh, the speakers would oh, uh, yeah, yeah. They, be they chattering, were. right? Any destructible environments at all, you've noticed? Uh, huh? No. That would be very cool. That would be nice. <laughs> I feel like that map would be leveled in 10 seconds. Shh. Yeah. Well, two minutes, that's the first mech call. <clears throat> I think it's four first. Four minutes. Uh, we'll have to look and see for sure. Um, yeah, it's weird. The second environments around the time of a uh, Red Planet felt like it was going to be the next big thing, but then I think people realized the more liberal you are with that, it's it's actually kind of, it's probably really hard to do. Or, yeah, and then make a game fun. Red Faction what was that Red Faction? Yeah, the old ones. You could you just wind up with like a flat surface that you're all playing on. Red Planet's the movie, isn't it? 
What was that? Red Planet's that Red movie? Red Faction. <coughs> Red Faction, right on. Yeah, that's what I thought. I have an idea, Jeff. All right. Let's win. Val Kilmer in Red Planet. Okay. What do you think? I did a screened feature for that and uh, Mission of Mars and, and Red Planet, we watching that. That was not a good movie. <laughs> yeah. It's not, not a good movie. Apparently he and uh, Tom Sizemore just stopped talking by the end of that production. Who, who did? Uh, uh, Val Kilmer and Tom Sizemore oh, wow. just, just weren't talking at all. Did you, see, so. uh, did you see that business with Sizemore last week about Bill Clinton? Yeah, yeah, I, I did really, hear about that. And like the next day, he totally recanted the whole thing. Hey, man, let's hurry. He was just like, oh, I was, I was. I've had, I've had some problems with drugs. <laughs> yes, he has. What? Uh, you should go read the article. I'll, I'll send. Hey, what's up? Oh, he said uh, Liz Hurley had an affair with President hey, Clinton. Well, not only did he say that Clinton had a, a like a year-long affair with Liz Hurley, uh, but he was giving like specific, like verbatim, conversations that he had had with the president, where the president basically just said. Stop fucking around. I'm the president. Give me her number. Yeah. I'm sending a plane to get her. I don't have kind time to wait for you, Liz Hurley. I've got to save the world over here. Uh, and she, yeah. of course, everybody like denied the, it. Like the, the very next day, Sizemore was like, I, I like how I've Sizemore's some, just writing, writing like fan fiction. I've had some trouble. Yeah, it sounds like a porn movie. It basically was like, don't listen to what I say. So you can wall mount in this? Like, uh, shove your knife into a wall? You can wall. Is that? I'm trying to. I'm not sure how you do it. Jump an LT, maybe? Drop oh, kicking a wall. Oh, cool. yeah. That's weird. It looks like you're just stuck to it. Can Fly. you see your knife? Is that no, it just supposedly sticks. what you're oh, doing? Oh, that's weird. <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to be sticking your knife in it, I think. Uh, it just looks, looks funny. That's a sharp knife. Yeah. So I need probably get... a plasma knife or something. Oh, okay. Future, future knife. Nano. Get, get the Ow. A filament. It seems like this is a less action packed. Yeah, I, I ended up over here sticking knives into walls and. Everyone else went over to the other side. Nah. Let's get uh, a hot pistol. Mm. We're tightening on Alex. You have a chance to ask these guys if any burn cards are rarer than others? Like, are there some that are just really tough to find? If it's, like, completely random or otherwise? Yeah. I, I don't know. Um, like, are they... Are, I know that there was one, play, the, right? the one that was, like, immediately spawned in a, in a robot. Yeah. Uh, only I only saw that once. At so, the beginning of a match? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it's, like, pretty powerful. It's, it's pretty powerful, but it also makes you a big target, I assume. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. That's the Literally. thing. Like the, the robots Sorry. are not invincible, you know. Especially oh, yeah. if you are wow. careless with them, like they'll they'll go down. I think my robot is trying to follow me around this building, and, and I'm like we're just chasing each other. So in explain circles. that a little bit. The the AI dog mode thing that they have is that so you jump out of it and it's just automatically gets taken over yeah. by AI logic. So it just totally killed that robot and then died. I love you. Robot Robot. Uh, I assume you get all the experience for the kills your uh, robot makes? Yeah. Jump on his back. RJ oh, Cloney wants to know, uh, how often are you listening to these people talk to you? I have not heard a single word they've said. It doesn't seem very important. Uh, it's, it's really detailed if you listen to it, because it's stuff like, you are currently outnumbered two to one. Yeah. Or, you know, you have 25% of the points you'll need to win this match and, and stuff like that. What is this that? is actually relatively useful info. What is that ship doing? I don't know. So that voice chat is probably powered by the cloud, right? Like, it's all Oh, yeah. In real Everything. Time. Yeah, AI. of course. There's people in a bunker somewhere. <laughs> Actual people. Actual humans. Monitoring every match. It's the, the promise of EA Sports MMA finally brought to life. Oh. That hurt. The AI bot stuff is interesting. It'd be it'd be fun to see if you could like adjust the loadout of your team, like make them all snipers or something like that. But I'm assuming you don't have any kind of fine control like that. No, you don't. Oh! Oh! <clears throat> you excited, Benny? Yeah, it looks fun. Oh, how did he not die? 
you know, I don't think I'll be a competitive faller, but uh... Is that what we're gonna call people for this? Yeah, Fallers? Having every pilot have that, that rocket thing seems pretty, uh, pretty interesting choice. It makes them, yeah, it, 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 it prevents you from feeling like you don't have any answer to a yeah. Titan, you know? Can you uh, use that on another player? I'm assuming it doesn't it, lock it's on. It's locked on, so yeah, can it, you it, not it won't just lock free on fire? players. Um, the, other, the other weapon option you can free fire, so you could probably do that. Shock rocks. Cool. I killed a Titan. Oh, I'm dropping a Titan. Oh, I'm not. I don't spawn as a. Wait. What? Oh shit, it deployed my Titan and shit. then I died. Where is it? It's out there. It'll. It's the icon on the map. You see it? Or icon on the screen. Are you guys yes, doing any, right any kind of team teamwork stuff? You're just mostly doing your own thing? Shooting guys? Shooting guys? For my team? Yeah. It seems like a 6v6 will make it pretty easy for. Here, Titan. Don't die. For oh, he's dead. small groups to get together and actually have a. Titan. Yeah, so I will, we'll try last Titan standing, uh, which is. Oh, I'm stuck in the world there for a second now. Okay. Wait. Wow. Um, my Titan got it done. Last Titan Standing is a round-based mode, so since you don't respawn, there's probably a little more incentive to work <laughs> together. Is that somebody, is that bad guy Titan? Yeah, but it's it's in the the bubble. The bubble. If you walk in an enemy bubble, it'll kill you. They should use the bubble more. All units. Uh, are you using the the homing missile? Yeah. Uh, that's it's it, the homing missile is in the Titan, though not. Oh, this is not this thing. Yeah. As a Titan, can you dodge that once it's locked on? Uh, you can dash like, can and try dodge? to get around okay. a corner or something. That's probably the best way to do it. Oh, but it will follow you. It'll. Yeah. Okay. Have you looked at the options for this game at all? Uh, like yeah. what? What? Have, somebody was complaining about the uh, every time you switch weapons, it tells you what weapon you weapon you just switch to. It seems kind of uh, oh, man. seems kind of pointless and annoying. Man, this UI is so busy. So there you see those lock-on missiles, and well, I think we're fighting the same guy. That guy's dead. Where do we evac to? Uh, oh, where? Oh, by me. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> Hello? Stop shooting me! I got evac! No! Oh! Fucker! Sniped me. Oh, ignore that guy! <laughs> Did you get the sole survivor again? No, no shoot that guy! <clears throat> he was bleeding when you were shooting him. Guys, at the ready, just to get. Oh, oh wait! No. Nope. Take my gun. I did poorly. Yeah, I didn't do so hot either that match. But yeah, I think we can look at the options real quick here. Uh, so yeah, volume. FOV by any chance? PC version has it. Oh, it does? Okay, good. Look Drift, Drift Guard. Hey, that's what you Oh, I should turn that on. That's what you want, Brad. I think it's <coughs> it's oh, all by default. default. Oh, okay. Uh, and it's on the look, not on the move. You were yeah, the, the drift. Left stick the drift. drift. The drift, yeah, and this controller's on the left stick. Oh, boy. Learn how to make controllers, Microsoft. Come on. Evolved. Oof. Let's uh let's play last uh, Titan Standing. What do you say? So this is just like one life, one round. Yeah, uh, multiple rounds. Well, that's what I mean. But like yes. one yeah. life per round, I should yeah. say.
Well, you start in a Titan? Is that right? Yes, you start okay. in a Titan. Wow, so just 12 Titans on the map? Well, yes. All right off the yeah. bat? Yeah. Fuck. But you can't die. Right. And if your team runs out of Titans, but you're still alive, you still lose. But you can pop out and continue contributing. Yeah. By as long as you don't die. Rocketing those fools. Yeah. I guess I shouldn't. Well, I guess I'll take some. I guess I'll take those burn cards. How about that? Have you ever gone through a round and not have enough burn cards to get three the next round? Or do you always have, seems like you always have enough? I'm using them a lot more than than last time I played, yeah. so it seems like, they re seems like I will eventually run out. Or just get to this point with these where I don't really care about these. I didn't it, man, starting in 80 seconds, that's a really long time. If you don't spend them during the match, do you lose them? No. Okay. So, so if you if you back. put them if you slot them in but don't activate them, they'll come back. You think they'll add single player in future versions of this game? Future versions of this game? Like an offline like, single do you player? Think I think, I think it the... depends on how this does. Oh, it does? Like it's it's an interesting experiment. Oh, when you say future versions, you mean like sequel? Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, I guess that's always possible, yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I know, I, Call of Duty stuff, people always complain about the single player as being, you know, not, not everybody just plays, everybody just plays multiplayer, but... Hearing them talk about it, they seem very resolute about their decision not to make a campaign. Well, it's, it's, it seems like it's kind of smart business <clears throat> in a sense, because they spend at least as much, if not more, than they spend on multiplayer making a campaign for a yeah. Call of Duty game, and people either play through it once or nuts. Uh, Man, your your opponents here, pretty well. Is there a level cap to the beta? There must be. I don't yeah. know what it is. I'm, but... I'm assuming it might be 14. <laughs> no. I think you probably run out of stuff to actually unlock from level gains around 11 or 12. I think. Oh man, I'm gonna be sad if we don't get the full six on six. I just want to see hella titans. M Function wants to know what are the advantages of a titan? Just looks like a giant target so far. And that's that's kind of what I'm I'm thinking too. It doesn't seem like you do. I mean, I'm doing pretty good damage yeah. to other titans, um, but yeah, it, it's the right way to play with a titan is to be careful and back off to let your shields recharge. Yeah. And I hate doing that. <laughs> so. We also don't have to be in it, right? You could just have it. Right. You could stay yeah. on foot and have it just, you know, block for you. Yeah. <laughs> so I've just been getting in a titan, doing what I can, and then when it blows up, great, whatever. I'm having fun on foot. So. See you in two minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, look at this guy. Somebody linked to me in chat. Sk skateboarding dog plays video game. What was that game that had the skateboarding? Tony Hawk Ride. Tony Hawk Ride. Yeah, yeah look at him go. He's having he a good is, time. He's definitely moving. <laughs> it's adorable. Wait a minute. You think that dog is adorable? I do. Really? He thinks all dogs are adorable. Never would have expected that from him. I don't want to reduce build time. Oh! Little a robot. Punch out! Just fucking kill some robots. Oh, they're still, uh, they're still bots? Looks like. Yeah. So this is like last Titan to be alive? Yeah, you want to be on the team that has Titans left at the end. So can you just put, guard your Titan into a corner and then well, run out there yeah. and go fight? Yeah, you could. That's bad. Ah! Somebody, can you pop out of your uh, mech in this mode? Because yes. it seems like that would give you a bit of an advantage. Oh god, it's just a giant smoke screen. Oh, that mech's gonna die. Hell yeah, it is. At least I got the pilot. All right, let's see if I can land Reload on this Load that fucker. gun! Oh, nope. I gotta get out of here. Ah. Do it. Oh, shit. Oh, dude. That sucks. How many were left? Two, I think. It seemed like that was fighting two there. Any word on smart glass functionality for this game? No, I haven't heard. If they're doing anything uh, with that dumb stuff. Let's stick together. All right. Uh, do you only get one of that that rocket salvo? No, or it does it just take forever yeah. to recharge. 
Have you been able to change that out, or is that all that's in the beta? Oh, boy. Uh, yeah, 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 I just in unlocked that. the replacement for right, it. Cool. Oh, yeah, get fucked. Oh shit, I gotta go. You should be dead by now. Ah, well, so much for that. Oh, jeez. Hang on, I'm, I'm heading in your direction. Oh, maybe not. Oh my god, did he just send my robot rockets back at me? Holy shit. Wow. Yeah, I'm. this is not going to be the mode for me, because I don't care about keeping Titans alive. So I'm, I'm probably, I'm, I'll try jumping out this time. See how. Yeah. See you how mean, like immediately? Yep. And, and hide him. Huh. <laughs> Tell him to go high like duck behind a building. Yeah, yeah I'm in a corner. <laughs> You'll never find I'll him. Never find it. Well, here, yeah. you want to run escort with me then? Sure. But did everybody just jump out? Or are those grunts? No, those are grunts. Okay. That would be a really interesting uh, idea. See if you can jump on Brad's height. I don't want to ride on that fucking death trap. Oh, come on. You mean the guy with the most Titan kills on this team? What mechanics would you like to see refined before launch, if any? Anything just frustrate you or rub you the wrong way? There's nothing that's been frustrating yet. Yeah, hey, I don't want to jinx anything, but uh, I think your Titan's still at full health. <laughs> yeah. Kill that motherfucker. Yes. I think you got time for it next to you. Uh, I think they found your Titan. Boom! Just use this bait. Let them think that they're... Wait, how many are left? There's uh, one by me. I'm trying to get behind it here. Oh, my damage core. What do oh, I do with shit. it? <laughs> what do I do with my damage core? <laughs> Push down on the D-pad. I did. It takes a couple seconds to activate. Fuck, where is, where is a guy to shoot? Oh, well, yeah. Should have waited until you had someone to shoot. So I wonder what happens with my Titan now. Hey, I think he might have been dead. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. There's no any you kind of. You can do the uh, double jump while you're falling. Okay. So if you want to try to course correct and land on a guy, that's that's probably the best way to do it. There's no way to damage individual parts of the mech, is there? So I saw a lo like a, one of the loading screen tips was when the shield is down, parts will glow red. Whoa, whoa, wait, yeah, that is your Titan, those. Right? Sorry, yeah, yeah, Jeff, yeah, Jeff's Titan is still going. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to interrupt, but that was pretty weird. No, I've seen the glowing yeah. red thing. Yeah, that totally worked. Hey, not, not bad. Uh, I've seen the glowing red thing, but I wasn't sure what it Yeah, indicated. so that'll be a weak spot, I guess. <laughs> Switching sides. That was really silly. So if you guys all just leave your Titans there in guard mode, you'll just have That's an probably. army of Titans. They, they do defend themselves, right? Yeah, they do. Yeah. Set up a Titan trap, put one and then two flanking it. Right. And that was how General Caravella won us the war. There's nobody in those Titans! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, where am I? I don't know, Jeff. Did you just hide your Titan in a hole? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh oh. All, all by my lonesome over here. Where's Angel City located anyway? It's like. Just outside Detroit. So the grunts here oh. are, are kind of meaningless, right? You're not getting any. Yeah, more you're time. not. You're not respawning a titan or anything like oh, that. Oh, I guess you're getting damage core, right? If you're in your. Yeah, yeah. Titan. He's good. Okay, I need to find actual Whoa. titans to actually shoot at, like that one. Oh my God! What happened to my screen? Uh, you got hit with uh, one of those uh, anti-machine oh, grenades. Weird. It's it's buffering. Don't worry. Not enough keyframes. Is that a player? Oh, there's two titans over here being bitches. Uh, F you, buddy. That one's dead.
What do you think, Matt Rory? Well, I was never going to play this from when they announced it was online, oh, multiplayer only. Tour. It's not very... It looks really cool, though. It looks really fun, but I just have not played multiplayer games in a long time. Seriously, you know, in a long time, so... No! Oh! Thing, but, fuck. Oh! <laughs> just got my damage core. Oh, he... Fucker. Can you see the appeal? Yeah, definitely I can. I mean, I it seems like this would be a fun game to spend an afternoon on, but in terms of paying 60 bucks for it, it's not... I would, I would probably find something else first. Well, you're in luck. Dark Souls 2 comes out the same day. Hmm. What if you could be a robotic puppy? Do you see any? No. If there Robots? Dogs, like four, four legged dog next to Yeah. Oh, wait. Here's might be, one. Might be nice. What is he? He's just sitting there. He's just standing there. Blow AF it up. AFK. Well, well, maybe that guy got out of his Titan, too. That's yeah, you it, was chatting. Right. it says auto Titan if, uh, oh. if they're not in it. Where are you? Yeah, uh, you got it. I don't think you're, so your Titan never took any damage, Jeff? Nice. Wait, so you spent that whole round on foot? Yeah. <laughs> Do you run out of those rockets? Oh, uh, you have like 15, so oh. that's usually enough. Can you only dash forward with the Titan? No, you can dash oh. sideways. Oh, wow. Holy so shit. Can, yeah, can you give us the uh, rundown on the mode? <clears throat> like, there's only four in this. There's three. Three in the demo? Um, or three yeah, in the game? Three in the, in, the, in, the, in this demo. In the beta, please. What I, so one's just regular old deathmatch, one's last Titan standing. Yeah, and then there's uh, control domination. point, like domination, basically. You just put him on follow? No. You are dead. I like this mode. Yeah? Yeah, I like all this big robot violence. This is fun. I don't like caring about keeping shit safe. I want everything to blow up all the time. Actually, <clears throat> I'm finding it more satisfying now that I am focusing on keeping it alive. Because I'm, I'm dodging more and like using the reflect and all that stuff. Yeah. Like yeah. yeah, I guess it, you know, it's good. Have they mentioned any uh, me other more. modes for the uh, shipping game? <laughs> no, I, I don't know if really they have. Uh, I mean, I'm, it must have them, but... Oh, Hello. no! Hey, how are you? <clears throat> How do you guys feel about the sensitivity on the uh, controllers right now before the patch? Uh, it seems fine. Yeah. You guys are mobbed up. Wow. Yeah, run away. Oh, here comes damage core. Yeah. Ah! Now give me something to shoot. Yeah, that's what I get. For locking on and not being somewhere where I can get out of the way. Because as soon as you lock on, you see that someone's trying to lock on to you, so... But your Titan, can you can you switch to your Titan in the view? No. Okay. Fuck. Pop that damage core and didn't have anything to shoot with it. Yeah, don't do pop it until there's I did, like I, I did, and then he died oh. immediately. Do you lose it if you don't use it? it well, yeah, yeah it, lasts, it, it only lasts a few seconds. It's a really short... It's like 15 seconds or 10 seconds. Yeah. Somebody else hide their Titan? Saw rockets getting shot. Something going all over here. Just, Alex just shooting yeah, everything. Just dumping. Where is that Titan? Well, you're heading towards where we spawned. Because you're heading towards my Titan. Which is on your left. So. Hmm. I'd head over towards their spawn, which is where the A point is in control. Do you know if. Oh. Do you know if Titans show up on the map if they're not firing or anything? I like think that? if they're not firing, they don't. Hmm. Tricky business. Possible to go first person on spectate? Uh, I don't believe so. I didn't. I mean, it didn't look like the buttons were there for that, but Seems I don't know. Curious to I'll not have it. any kind of third person for the uh, for the movement here. Seems like with the parkour stuff, it's always pretty tough to pull it off. I don't know. Does it's, it feel, it's, feel okay? It feels fine. Yeah. Uh, that hasn't really been a problem. Because yeah, you're not it. doing like full on. Oh damn it! Get out of there! 
you know, you're not doing full on Mirror's Edge type shit. Yeah. Oh man, they don't want that party coming. Yeah, through. that's bad. <laughs> coming <laughs> away. Yeah, oh. right. I should have. I should have not stood oh, there and boy. done that. No, no first person from the looks of it. It's just next to previous. None of the other buttons do anything. Oh shit. I guess Call of Duty had a first person. Uh, Holy shit. shit. Yeah, you just walk around the corner and just shit. So if you die and your Titan is still out, does your Titan blow up too? No, it stays out. Huh. What do you think would happen if all the humans die and all the Titans are still alive? You just watch them kill each other? Oh man. Would that be cool? That would be really cool. I bet if all the humans on a side die, yeah, it probably the ends there over. too. Because if you had a bunch of them in guard oh, mode, they would never go find each other. Come here. You got a guy behind you. Uh, I got this damage core. Fuck off. Oh, that's so satisfying. Careful with those smoke clouds, they do damage. Oh, wow. It is electric smoke. There's a guy oh, on you. There's a guy on you. There's a guy on you. Get out. Get out. Kill the guy that's on you. Get out. How do I like, shoot him? All right, he's. I can't he see appears him. To be dead. Fuck, and you are also dead. God damn it! Wait, your Titan's he's off to fight. Oh, that sucks. Dead. Your Titan's gonna kill another Titan. Yeah. Oh, he did he jump? Oh, that that is a real bummer. We've got two guys on foot and some robot Titans. Uh, oh, your Titan's dead. Oh, but mine is still hidden somewhere, I think, right? You sure? I because think so. no Be one has... Oh, wait. That uh, thing is pretty Whoever that up. is. And there's someone on it. Yeah. Oh, no, that, that's oh, that's our guy that's on it, killing that robot. Whoop. <laughs> oh, it was about to blow. Oh, jeez. I should put a rocket on that thing. Wait, so none of your team is in a Titan? Nope. But your Titan's But my alive. Titan's still alive over oh, there. Wow. So you can see the, the ah, icon just stand there. there. Oh, that's pretty good. That's some good I finished business. in last place, but I'd say I was pivotal to the victory <laughs> of our team. Hmm. Uh, well, we, we can go into the variety pack playlist, which just is random stuff. Oh, yeah, I got smoke. Cool. Like Any way smoke. to cancel a reload animation, like by dashing or anything? Like uh, that? You can, I know you can in the Titan because I was doing it. Hmm. I mean, you, you can, can you can switch weapons. You can uh, that'll, uh, that'll yeah. force it. Yeah, in the Titan you can like punch out of the reload. Oh, so you finally you did you have custom Titans now? Yeah. But it's still limited for the uh, for the beta. There's only like, yeah, there's only so much gear in in here, and I think this is actually most of it uh, as far as like the default weapons go. Like there's still unlocks to unlock. Let's see how close I am to. Getting something for the submachine gun. Oh. Yeah, if you have a second, uh, I think people wanted to see the weapons and stuff that you have available. Yeah, sure. I'm assuming so, this is still pretty limited, too, though. Yeah, so on the pilot side, these are the guns. Uh, you got the standard assault rifle, shotgun, the smart pistol, which locks on, kind mm -hmm. of Panzer Dragoon style. Uh, the submachine gun is what I've been using. It's been okay so far. And then a sniper rifle, which is for sniping. Um, and they've got attachments, too. So uh, it seems like the assault rifle has way more than the submachine gun. You're using the SMG? Of, uh, yeah, I've been, using the, I've been using the SMG. You like it better than the carbine? Right. I think so. I don't Try know yet. That. Any way to uh, attack pilots directly while they're inside a, a, a mech? With no. The if, if, the, if the mech is doomed, then you can punch them to grab the pilot out and crush them. But that's, that seems, I, I think can that's I it. Can I snipe a pilot in there? Yeah, no. I don't, well, I don't think so. Um, Doesn't seem so like you have attachment well. and you have mods. So mods is like extended mag, higher fire rate, and a... Uh, silencer, that sort of stuff. Anti-Titan weapon, there's no attachments for it. Pistol doesn't look like there's any attachments for it either. Can Titans jump? No, they can dash. Hmm. Same Sh thing. Should Titans jump? Should Titans uh, these, these are the, the perks that are available. There's the hang longer, more explosives, uh, faster recharging tactical, which is like your cloak. I the hanging, I'm not seeing such it's a like great It's like if you're inside for... and waiting for someone, yeah, like and you're wall, hanging like from Batman a wall. Style. Yeah, yeah. You know, it, it would work if you were like guarding a position or mm. something like that. 
uh, longer battery. Uh, minion detector puts all the AI guys on your map at all times, hmm. which has Seems been kind of useful. If you want to farm. And then if you want your, uh, your Titan to warp in instead of jump, it'll warp in more quickly, I guess. What does that mean? I think it just appears faster when you ah. call it in, but hmm. I think it's probably a different animation of it warping, popping into view instead of falling out of the sky, I guess. I'm not sure. Don't have it unlocked yet. Uh, and Dorsky wants to know how easy it is to pull off the uh, jump on a Titan. You just got to land on just it. Just kind of land on it. It's, yeah. But they're moving around a lot. It's, yeah. And you got to worry about being smashed. Yeah, yeah. So if you know if, if you're on a rooftop or something like that, you can just kind of fall onto it and, and and do it, and then you can be a you know, man or a lady. Yeah. And uh, then in the Titans, we got uh, like I said, you know, it's the only chassis in there. Have they said how many there'll be in the? I think they've only announced three. I'm not sure if there's a lot more. of room on yeah, that list. Yeah, a lot of room on that list on the left. So, yeah. uh, quad rocket, a single shot uh, weapon, and a fully auto. Now they said so. They said no microtransactions, but that doesn't mean they might, might not be like DLC. They will definitely. Or... They're definitely doing maps. Yeah. Uh, electric smoke. I like electric, <laughs> electric smoke. Electric smoke. So Sounds if, like if a... you have someone who has landed on your your robot and is trying to shoot you down, the smoke will ah. take care of them. It's not a Jimmy Hendrix album? Yeah. Uh, and then the kind of dumb fire rockets and the lock-on rockets uh, for, for Meta Titan. And, and then you've got regen booster, bigger explosion when you blow up, faster reload. Faster reload on your right bumper, like your your uh, rocket stuff. Ooh, that would be nice. And then the only thing they have here is slower health uh, degeneration when you're doomed and uh, auto-eject. I'd be very happy if they fill those lists out. Yeah. Like that would make this game yeah. more interesting. The, uh, the perks and stuff. Like the, for the length of those uh, lists, windows. Yeah, those windows. Like if those, if they had that many options, it would make fighting other mech really interesting. Yeah. It would make using your mech really interesting. I mean, we just go into like beta variety pack, which is just it throws all the modes into one playlist and stuff. So. As far as you guys know, is, is this uh, on the public facing front? Is this about it until release? Yeah, I think so. This is not like another beta or something. No, no, this this is it. I think. I mean, I mean anything could happen, but yeah. That's, yeah. Today is the 13th, right? Yeah. Indeed. Uh, so yeah, by a the, little by, under a month. Yeah, but by the time this beta is up, it'll be like three weeks till release. I'm assuming that Gone Gold announcement will come some, sometime soon. Yeah. Like, again, it's it's weird weird to call it a beta because generally beta is like soliciting feedback, but. Uh, they did say. Um, I, I assume there might be like a day one patch or something like that. Could be. Yeah, and they they did say that there was still some some data they're interested in getting. Some big data? Yeah, they're, they're interested in collecting big data on like server stuff. Like, yeah. Respawn has a guy up at Microsoft right now staring at like. Well, it's really weird. Staring I mean, at like screens going 15 mm -hmm. monitors in, in a GTA row. 5, I, I saw that room, the room that, yeah. like, that E works in. Like, yeah. I, I got to, I got to cool see it last time I was there. It's, it's, it? it's like real NASA command yes. center -y looking. Oh, it's, man, it's I want to see that. Neat. I'm just curious what GTA 5 Online kind of taught companies because GTA 5 Online was not ready at launch. They waited like two weeks for people to die off and then it was fine, or as far as I know, it got better. And it's it's the weird thing where you, if you invest a huge amount in servers for a launch, you are paying too much because right. after three weeks. It's supposed to be the thing that Microsoft server infrastructure is supposed to allow is that yeah. you can kind of spin up or spin yeah, down as many to, as you need. I think so it's you supposed can kind to scale. of handle your launch quantities and scale it down at the end, you know, when, when that tapers off, I guess. but. Uh, you kind of only pay Microsoft for what you're using as a developer. Uh, this is a good question from Nerujo. Uh, any any idea why they went with Source over Frostbite? I mean, EA's kind of using Frostbite for the... For this isn't an EA game. It's an EA Partners game. Oh, uh, okay. So they probably wouldn't even let these guys use Frostbite if they wanted to. Mm. Oh, come on. Oh, <laughs> just a little bit? Well, maybe they would, but that, that business would include, like, now you can never publish this through anyone else because you're using our tech and all yeah. that. Yeah, that would be... Do they use uh, trigger vibration motors on this? No. Uh, how come they're not using id tech? Because no one is using id. <laughs> Actually, because Bethesda's not licensing it out yeah. anymore. Oh, that's also, right. I forgot they yeah. stopped doing that. Yeah. Huh. But also... Uh, it's pretty much source. Yeah. <clears throat> it's pretty much source Unreal or CryEngine at this point, right? Unity. Unity. Oh, well, yeah. Unity, but I don't know that Unity is up to something like this. So we will play a little PC version a little bit later, but is that using... Yeah, let's play like one more of these, and then I'll, I'll hop over That's to PC. That's not Origin, correct? So that would be Origin servers and not the Microsoft servers? My understanding mm. is actually that every version is using the Microsoft yeah. servers. Huh. That's a weird... Uh, that must be a weird business 
Is yeah. That, well, I don't know. I, I mean, those Microsoft servers are available to anybody. That, <laughs> like the, the Azure service is, is but you'll, an existing service. But you'll probably have to buy this through Origin. Yes, yeah, you yeah, yeah, definitely. Or, origin will. mandatory, I think. Is what they uh, and it's cool. You said you were going to play this with a flight stick, which is of course crazy. Yeah, no, yeah when you get into the mech, you know, we you can see up. right naturally. Let's go for Alpha. What is the storyline thing behind these hard points? What do they do for you guys you beyond have to, just like you got to hack into them? You get <laughs> you want big them data. data. Yeah, that's where the big data is. <laughs> and because this was a little confusing to me, so I'll just reiterate this and clarify as you see fit. This is the pure multiplayer. Yes. This has nothing to do with the yeah, single Yeah, this is not player. campaign Ooh. multiplayer. Did I just do that to myself when I, I executed a guy while cloaked? Uh-huh. And, and my what? view went insane? Oh, was that I because I tried to attack a guy while I was cloaked? No, I don't know. Like, do you suffer for that? Maybe. Probably not. Did one of those grenades go off near no, you? No, maybe that's what it was. I wonder how the matchmaking stuff for the single player slash multiplayer thing will go. Yeah, well, so the only reference to it in this beta is when you're turning the audio, like the, the volume up and down. Yeah. It all says classic multiplayer. And uh, then in the little tool tip for it or whatever, it says like, you know, volume for campaign multiplayer will not be affected. Oh, wow. So that's the only... Making a run on Alpha. I'm on it. We'll ha I'll have it by the time you get here, probably. So I'm here. All right, good. I don't have it yet. Oh, there's a guy coming in. Oh, he's dead. Got it. I wonder if there'll be uh, any. Oh, it's got. Oh, there's a guy. It's great tactical. Uh... <laughs> Call out there, Brad. I wasn't really talking to anybody but myself. Maybe there'll be, ah! maybe there'll be stuff in the single player that is more like a, other modes, like a horde mode against AI, or if you fight big boss robots, you know, like a giant mech boss with your six dudes. Yeah. Or what if it's just like, ah, that's like ahead of the IMC, ten That was terrible. Like for whatever reason, he the way he was jumping up over the building, he looked really big for a second. I'm like, oh no, robot! So I switched to my robot gun and then he was not a robot so by the time I switched back to my regular gun that he kicked me, me in the day, face though. you just see a person and go oh no robot yeah and then I switched my other guns yeah is there any uh <laughs> yeah that guy wow that out. guy did not last for no. long <laughs> oh no I got away like two minutes the uh is there any special move if you dash and punch you do like a no no uppercut doesn't look like it And there's no grab, right? You can't, there's no grapple. Uh... No. How's this game for colorblindness? <laughs> oh, it's fine. Billy Mays. I like that they've, uh, well, I don't know that I like, but I noticed that they have switched from red and green to blue and orange for the team colors. Because they're, they're humans. Because they're, they're edgy. No, oh, because they understand that. Look at this. Look at all. There's all this blue even in the map design. <laughs> blue and orange. Oh, man. The guy wants to fight. I need to finish reloading this gun. I'm stuck. Yeah, shield. Go for it. I don't even know what happened at the end there. He blew up. Man. That's all I know. I'm gonna blow up. Oh, but you're in a building. I'm in a building. That's bad, right? <laughs> Goose. Oh shit. That was bad. All right. Are we losing anything? All right. How are the polls doing? I'm doing all right. Losing a. Doing doing a okay. Oh really? The, if you could add one thing to Titanfall, it would be 
I'm surprised big head mode has made it that high. That was not my Where's it? Oh, he was wall hanging. He got me. Did you see that? Oh, he sat you... there and stared at me for a while. Ah. There you go. <laughs> Whoa. That was fucking... I, I couldn't figure out where the fuck that guy was. That was pretty rad. They got a car. So the people at Respawn do not ever use the word mechs for these guys. I'm assuming they're pretty good about sticking to Titan on it. Yeah. Pretty, they're staunchly anti mech. Oh, you got him. Nice. Fly swatter. Oh, for hitting a dude that's yeah. stuck to a wall? Hey, wait. I could do that. Now you can give somebody else a fly swatter. How do you do that? Left trigger when you're up against a wall. Oh, wow. Like while you're wall running? Uh, no, you have to jump, jump right into it, I think. Huh. You think there'll be like servers where you can just farm this? Everybody agrees that like, all right, we're gonna get the fly swatter achievements. You guys go up against the wall. Uh, everybody else goes up against the wall. The challenges don't. It's stuff you'll just kind of get, you know? Hey. Oh boy. Hey, buddy. Now it's just getting silly. Yeah, now you're just being crazy. So Brad, do you feel like this is scratching an itch or is this making you want to play more? No, what do you mean? Like, like, am I getting what I want out of this beta? Yeah. No, it's actually making me it's making you hunger for more, more excited for okay. the full game. Definitely. Uh, like I'm, I'm kind of with you. I, I want to see what the other like mech options are and stuff. Yeah, definitely. What the other stuff is you can equip. I mean, I'm already having fun with what's here. Oh, oh shotgun! Is that a good guy? It or takes bad a while guy? to change weapons. That, that I'll, I'll say that much. Like, because every time I change watch, when I change back to my primary, okay, that time he didn't. Okay, I thought he, I thought he cocked it every time. Yeah, but. that that pop up to show you what weapon you're using is pretty annoying. The you, I I don't even notice it. Yeah, I think, I, I get, I think I get like watching you play. You just kind of yeah. look right past it. I get really weird about UI stuff like that. It's, yeah, it's anything. I usually am too, but it's like like I said, it's it's just. I thought the leash seemed really silly. The like. The yeah, beam. that big beam there. Is, I don't know. Man, we are working them this time. And some UI designer who spent like a day putting that thing on is now. Yeah. Super bummed yeah. Well, you said that. I get I get I get really picky about weird little stuff. So. Um, don't take my. I have not played this game at all, so don't take my opinion as, as anything other than some some dumbass on your. Oosh. Hey, you're approaching Charlie. Watch for hostiles. Whoa! Bravo is under attack. Dick. Be advised, Titan ready in 30 seconds. Take it, Charlie. Fuck you. Shit. I don't think so, fucker. Surprised there's, surprised there's no, uh, like, the golden mech mode where. Uh, there might be. One dude. That's true. Well, there is now. Okay, your Titan's stuck for launch. Call it when ready. Right, we win. We we Victor Y. Shit. I'm just gonna drop my Titan on their drop point. I thought it didn't drop on buildings. So it, we're not on a building for this one. So oh, right now. fuck. So there he is. I should have tried to drop it on their drop ship. <laughs> that might not have worked, but might be too late by that point. Take it out. Did anyone get in? Well, that guy's gonna do. Ah! Oh. Oh. What's the health on it? Man, <laughs> I really want to see a dropship get exploded. Yeah, yeah, me too. Uh, so they don't track Titan kills in that mode. Assault defense. Yeah, I guess not. 
I mean, you get points for it, but you know, since they can eject, it's not necessarily right. So, uh, how would I pop out of this and we'll try the PC version? Sure. Cool. Sure. sure. Oh, okay. That so I unlocked a really good idea. Okay, that so I unlocked great. a couple of things for. I uh, finally unlocked the first submachine gun fire. thing. Less accuracy, no thanks. This game's already too, like, medium distance to not have accuracy on a gun. All right, so I'm gonna back out of this and leave you guys. Wait, an envelope has been left under my door. Oh no. It has no postmark or identification. Oh, you just got burn cards? Yeah, that's burn cards. So what is, it's got a letter is from like an advocate. magic or something? Uh, like, here's a real physical card that you can burn and you'll get mm. some, that's, that's really weird. Maybe this is all a simulator. I like it. Yeah, maybe that's the, the end, uh, the end uh, thing. Uh, Drew, you, you probably have to do some uh, physical swap there. Do you know how big the install of the beta is on the PC, uh, Jeff? I don't. Hmm. I set it up to download and then walked away. Are you going to play this with a gamepad or a keyboard mouse? I'm going to try both. All right, cool. And uh, don't forget the flight stick. <laughs> yeah, that's really weird. You got you got disconnected really quick from that. Well, it's a beta. They may have that. Oh, uh, you're looking at there. I thought that was yeah, the, that's, still that's the PC. Xbox. Okay. Oh. So let's look at the options real quick here. Okay. What do we got? Uh, I'll turn voice chat down. Sure. How about that? Controller settings, same basic stuff that you saw on the other version. Also drift guard, that's interesting. Yeah, mouse keyboard, mouse acceleration off. Actually, I should see what the key bindings are here. Uh, mouse three for tactical, well, whatever. It's, there are not that many buttons at all. You ever use uh, middle mouse click for anything? Occasionally. Yeah. I like. But it now for... that most mice, this one does not, but now that a lot of them have like a thumb button, that's usually yeah. where I move my melee now. What's your color modes? Oh, wow. That's interesting. The field of view goes from 70 to, 90, 70 to 90. I guess it's enough for personal preference, but not crazy high for people like to see half the world at one yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, all right. How about I leave it like this? Yeah. Is the lighting quality as high as, that, as, high as it goes? Is there a highest? No. Low or high? Okay. That's it. Texture resolution, resolution will go to insane. Hmm. Let's try that. It needs three uh, gigs or more of GPU memory. Do we have that, Brad? Ooh. That sounds right. What uh, like I think those are two gig cards, but I'm not sure. Well, it's just see what happens if you do it. What is it gonna What's it gonna do? Blow up? I mean, I kind of just want to play the game. It'll It'll just really probably get real chunky. Stick around with stuff, but uh, uh, but we're here to see it look different. Yeah, right? you're right. PC is 20 gigabytes for this uh, this beta apparently. That's Jeez, crazy. Maybe he means for the whole game. Yeah, that's something nuts. Brad, can you quickly throw out the general specs of this PC? Do you recall? Oh god, they're uh, they're Ivy Bridge i7s. I think they're 3750, 3700, whatever the kind of top tier Ivy Bridge was. Mm -hmm. uh, GTX 670. I think it's two gig. Like I said, how much memory? I think we put 16 gig of memory in there. I don't remember. Those things are almost a year old at this point. Burn them. Should probably throw them out a window. Yep. Somebody did uh, is mentioning I'll, double buffering VSync might be a little weird. I'll, I'll burn them at home uh, if that's cool. That's what it did by default. Yeah, yeah that's weird. That, that really screwed me up on uh, Assassin's Creed 4. For uh, so oh, we'll see how it works. Maybe it'll be fine. Uh, was it just something where it was in a lot of input lag or? No, it was double buffering on on AC4. Kind of made it if it was under 60, it would get locked to 30 or something oh. crazy. That I had I had a lot of problems with that game. Like people were telling me, had disable. Uh, VSync in the thing and then download this other program and let that run the executable through it and override the, the stuff and it'll all work fine and it, it never got any better so yeah I'm gonna get a PS4 at some point for infamous probably and I'll probably just mm. play it on that yeah so you can hack specters according to this thing right here which I imagine just makes them change yeah. teams or something number of ejections There's no forced tutorial before you get into multiplayer? Nope. It's there in the menu to, to play through it, but... 
Uh, the the Xbox version did force us into hmm. into a tutorial. I mean, I didn't quit out of it because I'd already played it. Right. But uh, yeah. It is weird that they are stacking one team or adding anybody on the other. One request to see the uh, see the uh, sniper rifle if you have a chance. Do not have it unlocked here. Oh well. Will not have it unlocked for a while. I don't, yeah, that'd be interesting to see how that, how that played out in a game like this. Uh, it seems like there are some close-in maps and some bigger maps, so. I don't know. I am rotten with a sniper rifle, so yeah, it would be a too. shot of me looking through a scope and shooting and it missing, and yeah. then people going, you're bad at games, and me going, nah, Nobody just, ever says that to anybody. I just don't them. like sniper rifles. You're just not finding a lot of PC people out there. Been you excited for Lords of Shadow 2? You know, Very. Demos, the demo's out on, on Steam now, apparently. What is, it, what is in the demo? Vinny, Vinny, don't, Vinny don't trifle with no demo. What's in the demo? It's the beginning know? of the game. I have no idea. Okay. I never played Lord of Shadow 1. Uh, do you recommend me do that? I think you might enjoy it. <laughs> I think you might enjoy it. Was it like an RPG or was it like a... Yeah, it's like, it's like an RPG. It's like yep. a tactical isometric RPG where you uh, are the Lords of Shadows and you fight Draculas. Cool. Yeah. Sounds good. It's weird. The only weird part is like they so they reimagined it. Like they took the Castlevania franchise and made everybody pugs. So I will have to get that. Yeah, it's it's kind of weird. <clears throat> All right, starting immediately with Last Titan Standing. Simon Pug, Trevor Pug, <laughs> Pugula, Zol Pug. Push Y to. It's a belly rub. Do, 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 This is the last time you're standing. Eliminate the opposition. You've got one shot at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. I like it. Yeah. That, that, that looks gun nice. looks pretty nice. Wow. Yeah. This, yeah, is that, really... this definitely looks a hell of a lot better. Yes. Yes, Oh yeah. Oh, that's bad. This is gonna be bad. You playing with the mouse and keyboard right now? Yeah. Oh man. Can you fire a rocket while you're uh, gliding down like that? If you switch over quick enough? Probably. That's a bummer. What the frame rate? No, how much better this looks. Oh come on, you knew that was gonna be the case, right? No. I, mean, I thought the Xbox One would be able to be modern. Modern, like any decent modern PC, is well, already, is already the, more powerful than yeah. either of the new consoles. Yeah. Definitely, the aliasing is a lot better on this version for sure. I'm not seeing any jaggies at all. Frame rate, ooh, that smoke yeah, frame is causing. Yeah. Maybe it's a double buffering there for the V-Sync. I've sure got like you, MSAA on and stuff too. Try so. switching off V-Sync entirely and see if that doesn't. Uh, switch off what? Oh, V-Sync? Oh, yeah, yeah sure. uh, maybe that'll actually probably that'll drive people Triple crazy. Triple buffer, double buffer, and disabled yeah. are your options there. Uh, if we turn on disabled, it'll probably drive people crazy for the, the tearing, but maybe there won't be much tearing if it's if this is a... Uh... I usually that roll with V-Sync off. Yeah, me too. I, tearing does not bother me as much as it does some people. What's that new with the monitor, with the NVIDIA thing? Whatever. Oh, the um, G-Sync? I only use G-Sync, <laughs> son. Yeah, I thought. Yeah, I th this does look this does look a lot sharper. I thought that there would be a little more parity. I didn't think it would be this nah, drastic. Oh man. Uh, a couple requests to see the FOV too, if you get a chance, like sliding it up. There's some tearing. There's some tearing. Yeah, that's there's bad. some tearing. That's bad. That's not pleasant at all. But what are you gonna do? We turn VSync off. That's, yeah. a, that's that's a really that's, weird tearing though. It's like yeah, right it's in really. The, that's bizarre. It's like right in the center of the screen. Every time you're up next to like a. A vertical texture. You got him. Fire and forget. That really doesn't. Oh, I guess he had full shields. Yeah, yeah. So it kind of does. Oh, he's waiting for you. There you yeah. go. Yeah, if his shields are full, it doesn't really look like it. it does about a fifth of his health. Be a lot of rounds to take him down by yourself. Doesn't bum me out. It's not that it doesn't bum me out. It's just that I expected it. Mm. If that rocket misses, it doesn't lock onto something else. It doesn't yeah. surprise me. No. It just makes me feel like, why would I buy anything but exclusives on the? That's, yes, they, you, that is. Why is if you only have consoles? 
or a console? Uh, so I've been playing Battlefield 4 on a piece on a PS4, which you know, in in some ways, is kind of crazy because why would anyone do that? And here's why: I want to play that game on a controller, and I want to play it against people who are also using controllers. Yeah. Yeah, that, yeah, that's fine. But that you know. So that, like, this looks nice, and like it, I'm playing it with a controller right now, and it's controlling pretty well. But I'm never going to play this on the PC. Sure. That only covers competitive shooters, though. Yeah, exactly. That sure. only covers competitive shooters. If you're talking about like single-player games. Yes. Uh. And this is only 1080. I mean, you know, you get it, and and this machine's kind of old, so you could imagine you get that resolution up there. It'll probably look pretty good. Can yeah. You, can you blind fire that that uh, rocket launcher? No. It doesn't. You have to have a lock for yeah. it to go off. That's weird. Uh, otherwise, it would probably be unbalanced. Yeah, I if guess it, so. Uh, if you could fire that off just straight at a guy, because you know you're behind someone and shooting them. Brad, you should load up yours, and we'll, we'll just uh, uh, we can see if uh, side by side. Yeah, switch back and forth and see. Looks like the draw distance is better on the PC too. Do you want me to drop the textures from Insane down to high and see if that yeah, does yeah, maybe the frame rate? It looked like you had to bounce out of the game. The for Insane that. Yeah. might be going over the three gig. If you're a two gig card and you're running a three gig thing, it might be making it crazy. Oh. oh, you have to get even further back. But man, they did look nice. Those weapons looked. All right, we'll go to high. Let's turn double buffered. Try back triple, on. triple. I think that that's probably the, that's what everybody kind of recommends. So, and also if you have a chance to, to slide the FOV a little bit, I'm curious myself too. Oh. Let's just go all the way. Crazy. Ninety is not the. Incessant lowering of FOV in games is one of my least favorite trends. Like, it used to be 90 well, by default, now it's like some games are on like 50. Well, it's all a function of how far you are from your screen. So, yeah. something, something like 90 is more appropriate if you're right in front of a monitor. Yeah, I mean, but, I, I was playing Last Light. But it's kind of uh, too wide if you're like sitting 10, yeah. 10 feet from a TV. I never touch the FOV and never have a problem. <laughs> uh, I, I, was, I don't understand I was why it even exists. Yeah. Like, I, I just don't Ugh. fundamentally understand why I mean, people would do it. Well, people, I was playing Metro last night and it's, it's almost unplayable. As some, the FOV some, people have, the get, some people have motion sickness issues. If yeah, that's true. If some it's people too are suckers. <laughs> I, I don't I, I get that it causes options when you when you have the slider for it like sometimes you can start clipping on your weapons and it makes things look weird but uh, I, I prefer to have weird stuff like that and having the ability to adjust FOV then so kudos to them they have it All right, that's good I think more games should mm. oh wow apparently Brad, your, your counter is going faster was that Brad's counter is going faster than the counter. It's, you know, it's yeah. PAL versus NTS. <laughs> I guess, like your numbers are moving. Yeah, your sure. seconds, I'm pretty sure your seconds are going yeah, faster. About the same to me. So apparently on the PC, the controller has auto aim, which is yes. a, a weird, uh, a weird yes, choice. Yes, it does. Whatever. I feel like other games have done that in the past. I, where would, I would still take mouse and keyboard over. Controller yeah, I was gonna say like that's aim. not necessarily. <laughs> I'm telling you. Like, if you have a mouse and keyboard, like, and you've been playing games that no, way for a right. very long time, your whole body is auto aim at that yeah. point. Yeah, you're, you totally, got, you're totally right. You guys were like, eh. Nah, it's about 12 that, off. He'll probably. It's been, it's been think, about the same the entire time. Well, yeah, I think it's about the same. I don't know. Hard to tell. The great Titanfall controversy. <laughs> Xbox, Microsoft paid him so Xbox gets into matches faster. <laughs> <Yeah>. <gasps> the seconds are just a nano millisecond faster. It's like that banker that, that funnels all those fractions of a cent into That's his right. own account. You mean Richard Pryor? <laughs> well, uh, but who loads faster? I don't know. Well, you were 10 seconds ahead. I think we know. I think... Maybe I'm wrong. I would have assumed the PC would have taken this one. Hmm. Oh, yeah. There you go. Kill the Initiate drop All right. Let's switch back to mouse and keyboard. Wow, yeah, here. you're definitely caught up. Yeah, that FOV might be. Is that, this, is that too wide for you? From this far back, it might be a little much, but nah, 90 is not. Oh no. Oh. 
No, even even this far back, 90 is not not. Oh, no, grungy textures. Look at that texture. Oh, yeah. that's what are you playing? Quake? <laughs> Jeez. Oh, I wish. Yeah, but the frame rate's still maybe it's that triple triple buffer. Look at look at the fog in the distance on the Xbox One. And, yeah, it's way further back. Uh, it's like you're playing an N64 game. Over uh, there, I don't think I don't know that the fog is there to hide and draw distance. Because you can yeah. still see geometry through it. I got a burn card. Oh shit, I should use my burn card. Is it weird that I don't actually notice any difference with this FOV stuff? How do I use a burn card? Uh, it's a push Y. I mean, maybe if you're focused well, on a single screen, respawn. you probably won't see very much. Oh, right. Uh, I definitely I definitely notice it. Yeah. Notice it as soon as you jump out of a plane, so. Fuck. I guess it is a little different. I, yeah. It gets more fisheye the bigger it the yeah. bigger goes. You definitely notice it was like 110, but uh, 70 and 90 is not. <laughs> like when, that, when, when the rocket launcher becomes like just this weird. I, the, I like the kick. <laughs> oh, these guys are not smart at all. Are these all AI? Yeah, people? those are all AI guys. Wow. AI is not good. It's fodder, you know. They're they're there for funsies. They're not there to actually do work. You know, three points, you know. Yeah. How many people are in your match, Jeff? Is it full? Yep. Oh, wow. oh. We just captured hot point Bravo. Yeah, maybe the fog is the same. I don't know. Frame rate's still, uh, still a little hit and miss. Yeah. This is back on. This is triple buffered with the. This is uh, triple buffered. Normal. And 1080, right? 1080. Hmm. Yeah, maybe yeah. maybe a taxing game. Well, the triple buffering might be. Might be causing some frame rate stuff. That's more of an input lag thing, though, not necessarily a frame. Well, yeah, I guess actually, yeah. Could be causing frame rate stuff. Or causing it to be more noticeable than. Yeah, maybe. He is invisible. Let's be a robot. I like being a robot. Game seems like it'd be fun to fool around in. I bet it'd be terrible at it though. Fool around. Fool around. Like make out. Yeah. Find a nice quiet corner. For Titan. Auto Titan is lowercase on the PC. See? Duh. Yeah. It's terrible. What a crazy port. <laughs> yeah. Let me through, man! I gotta step on that guy! I think you don't have a lot of action happening on your screen, Jeff. Yeah. One of the requests is to turn as much stuff as you can down oh, to see boy. how you play on a, All right. a lower yeah. PC. <laughs> when you have a second. Or cool. don't if you don't want to. It's up to you. I wanna see that. It's always fun to see. You guys see the uh, Elder Scrolls Online stuff where you can turn it all the way down? It looks like an Xbox One game. <laughs> It's great. I mean, some people. Now you have... mean an Xbox One game or an yeah. Xbox One game? Xbox, no Xbox uh, original. Uh, but you know, hey, Xbox Classic. Hi. They want that game to be played by as many people as possible. Sure. People are still playing. Uh, Make it look like Morrowind. Yeah. People are still playing Ultima Online apparently too. So. Yeah, yeah, I've been seeing a lot of stuff about that recently. I. They still charge to play that. Yeah, online, right? like twelve ninety nine a month. Oh. Yeah! And people have like six or eight accounts apparently a lot of them do. Like that's a multi boxing. It's a decent chunk of money per year if you've been going for twenty seven years. Yeah. More than I am that game is. Launched in nineteen seventy four on a mainframe. Yeah. In Texas. PDP eight. Yeah. PDP twelve or whatever. They had to play it with punch cards, original. Yeah. It's right here. I was actually conceived in a Ultima, Ultima Online uh Mainframe room, <laughs> back corner. <laughs> Your parents met yeah. online. They oh. couldn't call it online then. That's what I get. No, she was a punch card operator for Ultimate Online. He was a tech on the mainframe. You know, one thing led to another. 
Oh yeah. What does that boop boop sound? Oh wait, rodeo That's attack. That's when your robot is uh, low shields. Ah. Yeah, that guy's just hanging. Wait, 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 that is not a knife in the wall. What is that? Oh, okay. Shoot him. Oh, We're just is. hanging. Shoot We're chilling. Him. Shoot him. Yeah, let's have a hang posse. Let's have a hot hang sesh. Get up here. Oh, I slipped. Oh, right, because you don't... I don't have the park. enhanced... Enhanced parkour kit. It gave you 75 points for holding on. Oh, the No, no, that's, that's holding yeah. on to the, the point, yeah. Victor Y. Jeez. You know, with the textures turned out, I don't see as big a difference. Yeah. Maybe that's why they called it insane. <laughs> Man, it's so... It, you want to look better than a console? You're insane! That's fucking crazy. That's, you want insane texture? I'll put it in there. <laughs> Uh, so that one rocket hit just shaved 26 seconds off my Titan build time. Nice. Like, it's crazy how, like, effective those rockets can be. Oops, I should have. I wonder if there's an option to just not download the insane textures and save yourself 10 gigs. A lot of games do that now where they'll patch in the, the really high-res stuff afterwards. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if they'll do Sleeping that. Sleeping Dogs did that. Yeah. But even the Sleeping, the Sleeping Dogs then, I don't recall. Well, it's been a long time since I played that. There was a high-res texture. There was. I don't remember it doing anything too crazy, but I do think it was an improvement. Oh, that game uh, was real good looking. It wasn't really? Yeah. I don't know. Although, like, the streets and the city and stuff? Driving in that game was not, not good. I'm going to throw this water on you. <laughs> how, did you how would you not like a game called Sleeping Dogs? What is I, wrong with you? I played 15 hours of that and stopped. I did not enjoy that very much. I liked it, but I also kind of fell off of it. What are they doing? The next game in that is going to be like some weird multiplayer thing or something? I don't know. Yeah, like it's not it's the not. same type of game or something. Yeah. Like like uh, gang wars or something like that. Okay, we're all good here. Hard points, Bravo and Charlie are still open. Get over there and pet. Whoa, that robot doesn't look like it's in good shape. Transferring to pilot. Whoa, whoa! Hi. Are you rearranging your dash between battles here? What are you doing, Brad? <laughs> Doing a little pin maintenance. Okay. Uh, question is. Um, oh, I didn't realize I was still on. I thought we were looking at the PC version. Can you shave off time for your next Titan while you're still in the Titan? Or no. Does the, no, the they, uh, it applies slip? to the damage core at that point. Ah, okay. We we can we can just flip over to the PC if you want. The battle's almost over. Well done. What happens if you hit X on your screen, Brad? Data center. Whoa. Pick another data huh. center. Interesting. Actually, lets you do that. Yeah. Neat. You don't see that I wonder if that'll there. be for the for the final game or because yeah. they're all dedicated servers, you know. Yeah, that's you know the cloud. Oh thank God. So there's no listen servers. No. I'm gonna hack this guy <laughs> with my knife. I like I like how he turned around and let you do that. Knife. Just, just oh man, there. you stuck your nectar knife into him and now he's gone crazy. It'd be great if you got points for every kill that you made now. I wonder if I will. I mean, he's got my name on him. Hey guys. Can you snap while trying to play, uh, Brad? Uh, yeah. Like, you can, you're not on the screen anymore, so it doesn't matter. You can do that with every game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh well. Is there a Twitch app for Xbox One? Oh yeah. For not viewing, yet. not for broadcasting. Can you snap the the Twitch app? Uh, try and find think, Giant Bomb. I think so. Our yeah. own feed. All right. Can you, you might? can you play while? Uh, while watching our, our feed? Maybe. I don't Chow. know if you can snap Twitch. You can snap Netflix and stuff, so I yeah. would think also, so. I, but I don't know how you snap stuff <laughs> without, without connect. connect. Double double tap the, the home button. What is going on in the background there? Looks like the earth is popping up or something. Wow. They were just violence. All right, I'll turn everything down. Yeah. Oh, yeah, try it out. I always find this to be a fun exercise. Just put it at 640 by 360. Yeah. We can handle the resolution switch too? We should be able to. Okay.
Feline, move aside. I cannot let you scratch our vessel, for I am drifting uninsured. What? You need to get insured right now. Oh, Katie. Now. Yes, but how, my suspended friend? I like advertise. Are you, are we watching his head? Yeah, we're just going to watch his head. Okay, so... Oh, that's as low as it goes. 720 is as low as it goes. Mm. Texture resolution low. Everything Anti-aliasing off. Yeah, everything low. Uh, V-sync off. I'm going to set the <gasps> field of view back down, I guess. So low. Low. No uh, bilinear filtering. Low. Disabled shadows. Low. Low. Disabled. Low. Mm. This is going to be... Does that look good, that look good yeah. to you guys? Wait, there was ragdoll? Wait, what's a low ragdoll? <laughs> Yeah, you know, like the physics on the ragdolls, like how much. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Apply. No, oh God, we're on the screen now. Ooh. Yeah, keep that resolution. Okay. Yeah, look at that perspective. Hey, that's me. Look at that aspect ratio. Can you snap that, Brad? Uh, not. F I don't think you can. I'm not mm. sure. Oh man, it hurts my head already. This even this menu. This is the only way to play to make sure that you get pinpoint accuracy. And Wait, frame what? What resolution is this? 720. It's well, this, uh, something's not right. <laughs> no, it's not the right aspect yeah. ratio. And that's showing up on the stream wrong too. Wait, I thought it was double tap. How do you snap? Oh, right, you have to go to the thing. I mean, we are, don't forget, we are taking this and then changing into 1280, uh, 720. What do you mean? This is 720 already. It's outputting 720. Oh, it wasn't 1024? It was 1280? I thought it was 1024, 720. That's not a real resolution. Yeah, it is. Is it? Yeah. Oh, so this is like a 4x3 then? I, I'm not like, sure. Because on this monitor, it looks fine. Ah. Uh, yeah, see, it, it's cutting off top and bottom. Mm. Mm -hmm, something, something about, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, wow. Wow. Awesome. See how the Xbox 360 version will look? It'll, uh, uh, this looks like a PlayStation like 2 version. Yeah. yeah. This well, is great. You should, you should try playing a PlayStation 2 game sometime. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, you trust me. Go play the go play the first kill zone and get back to me. Yeah. Okay, tough guy. That's you right. Got it. Mother <laughs> effer. Just yeah. saying, man. Boom. Oof. Ouch. In your fucking grill. Oh, my grill is full of it. You should try owning a Dreamcast sometime. Oh, man. Another sick burn. So because I don't have the custom classes, I, they give you, you know, some of the attachments and stuff. That's the HCOG scope. Mm. What does that stand for? Holographic, COG, COG optical, minutes. cyber. Call of Duty deals in ACOG scopes. So it's like this is combining the red dot, like holographic style with some kind of something. I don't know. It's a dead server, man. Guy this was doesn't just even jumping look, up into that window. This doesn't even look like the same game. Hey, what's up? Oh. We just lost Alpha. We're taking B. Oh, missed. Do you can't oh. snap Twitch? Yep. Check confirm. We got Bravo. Oh. You'll no. never, you'll never know. Uh, if the robot is being able to, oh, you can see it over there. Right? You have full screen. Death. Yeah, I do. It's uh, yeah. I mean, looks okay. Come on. This does not look okay. Oh, I'm not. I mean, if this was the only way it ran, then yeah, that wouldn't be okay. It's totally, but, it's totally yeah, playable. Yeah, looks I mean, texture, but I mean, it's, it's not like diamonds. It's not like I'm turning off all the textures in Quake or something. And this is what you get when you turn everything down. It's not, not uh, non-understandable. It's not non-understandable. But I'm not, uh -huh. I'm not understanding you right now. <laughs> At a certain point, I continued playing Quake One in software after I had a 3DFX card. Why? Because it ran faster. 
Uh, that should not have happened if you had a 3D effects card. Those things should have played at pretty, pretty solid frame rates. Yeah, not as solid as I was looking for. Hmm. Was it OpenGL? I well, yeah. that was the only option you had back then. Uh, Glide, wasn't it Glide on the uh, It was kind of yeah. a weird hybrid. There was a Glide wrapper for the oh! Yeah, I remember Glide the wrapper. He was pretty good back in the day. We just lost half point Alpha. I got nothing. Someone get over there. Oh, you're over here now. Hmm. You're ready to call your Oh, Titan's ready. Yeah. I do not like what I'm seeing down there. Let's see, I gotta see this Titan. High res Titan. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, that looks wow. pretty rough, oh, man. Oh, Lord. Oh, jeez. Hey, hi. Jeez, this, this is going bad. This is not going good. Oh, yeah, this FOV, or this, uh, could be after the ratio. Give you a little headache here in a bit. Oh. I got him. Oh, you got, got him. Someone hitting, got him. Hitting the window. <laughs> There's so much tearing. Yeah, it's like really, it's just constant. It's really bad. It's weird because you should be able to play this uh, like a solid frame rate. Pretty high frame rate. Uh, yeah. Wait, I mean that frame rate has nothing to do with tearing. I thought it's when the refresh rate and the frame rate get funny. Yeah, it's rendering faster than it's uh, than it's drawing in the screen, I believe. Right? Like it starts drawing another frame before the current one is finished. Yeah. So how does that how does that map? Uh, what, what, what I mean is uh, tearing is not a function of low frame rate. Uh, what do you mean, Brad? Uh, what do you mean, Brad? Figure it out. I'm not understanding. I always play with it off. I never. Yeah. Don't really understand all the technical details. Hi. How are you? I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk right up to you. <laughs> He really did. He's like, oh, I was trying to probably knife you. you Spawn in the Titan so we don't have to see the shogo like textures. Yeah, uh, somebody mentioned the grunt just faded out when they die. There's not really a, any kind of long term body count here. Which is kind of, uh, I mean, it's understandable in multiplayer they'd fade out eventually, but it seems like a lot of these guys are just die and then disappear. You want them to stack? Yeah, I love that. Uh, stack up bodies. See how long it takes to kind of go. Yeah, see, we just fade away. That's what old I have high expectations for games now. I don't know why. I'm getting more picky as I grow older. I mean, would you really want like a field of corpses? No, not a field of corpses, but you know, have them last uh, 30 seconds or something like that. Yeah. I understand that's probably not possible with mechs, but little dudes. What's your next big release? Well, probably at this point, Dark Souls 2. That's what, March 8th or something like that? 11th. 11th, so same day as this. Yep. Uh, and then I, I really want to I want to know more about Infamous on PS4 before I buy a PS4 and just play that game. But uh, I really do like those Infamous games, so I'm really uh, excited about that. You got him. Oh, he's already there. dead, though. Oh, Lord. Oh, oh, that looks real rough. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh! I got him. Well done. We both, like, I forced ejected off of that uh, blowing up thing, and then he ejected too, and then I killed him. You know, somebody's making the point, they might be disappearing quick, the bodies cause a low magdal. That might be true. Uh, are you gonna play Dark Souls 2 on a PC? No, I'm not gonna wait three months if okay. that's what it's gonna be. Oh, I'll get on PS3. But they have not announced their PC launch. No, and from what Brad was saying, it sounds like they're cagey enough to make it think that they're not going to be like two weeks after. So. I mean, all, all, all we know is what that guy told us in the interview, so. What did he tell you in the interview again? Uh, I mean, it was it was all very vague. Yeah. Like, it just, it sounded to me like it was going to be a while. But, you know, who can say? Now, if they, it feels like if they had a firm date in mind, they yeah, probably would have. Eh, not necessarily. It's coming up soon. You don't I be mean, surprised. I don't know. It doesn't sound like I mean, it's a day and date, so. If you want everybody to buy it on the platforms that are harder to pirate on, yeah, I guess so. Then you don't tell them when the PC version is coming out. Hell yeah. Video games. 
happen. Video games. How about you? What are you, what are you looking forward to? You thinking you're gonna buy uh, Titanfall? Uh, yeah, 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 definitely. Uh, I'm not sure which platform though. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm looking forward to Lord of Shadow 2 and Dark Souls 2. The hell? Uh, also looking forward to Infamous. Looking forward to more game announcements on next gen uh, platform. All right, that was definitely auto aim right there. It was kind of curving me around that. Oh yeah. Uh, at that guy. So yeah, this E3 coming up is going to be really interesting. I think it should be a uh, should be fun to see how how well it works. So apparently, uh, PS4 has outsold Xboxes two to one in January. What uh, the NPD numbers are saying? Huh. That's a fair advantage. I, I'd be really curious to see what uh, Microsoft does to the perception. Ooh, yeah, wow, that is that is straight up quake oh, two man. style style stuff. I almost think that looks worse than quake oh. two. <laughs> yeah, that the textures up close look real fucking terrible, or at least those ones do. Ah, yeah, this or terrible, if you know what I mean. No, uh, go ahead, go ahead and. Can't really do a pun like that. In audible, <laughs> can't do an audible. <laughs> oh, we got audible. Keep going. We're gonna pull an audible on that pun. Anymore. Keep going. Digging that hole. Not liking what I'm seeing out there. <laughs> this pun was pull brought to you by on Audible. Uh. To get your free pun, use code <laughs> Giant Bomb. <laughs> Giant Bomb and Audible right now. Oh! What did this guy do to me? That. Oh, he's from long. He's downtown, too. From downtown! Well, he's got a sniper rifle and he's jumping! Go oh, what? Yeah, no fall damage, it looks like. Can you pick up a Titan weapon uh, if you're no. human? That'd be awesome. Yep. Well, have we exhausted all of the Titanfall coverage we can exhaust? <laughs> we've, we've set the yeah, resolution, we've played all the modes. It'll come out and we'll see how many maps it has. And that'll be uh, a determining factor, I think, for a lot of people. Like, how much content is actually here uh, beyond this. I think the core of it's really fun, though. So, mm. wow. uh, if, there's a, if there's enough to it, then it'll probably be pretty good. I agree. Uh, yeah, so that's going to do it. Robot yep. Jocks is uh, going to be in stores next month, I guess. Part man, part metal, mm. the ultimate killing machine. That's me, the ultimate killing machine. Level five. So thanks for watching, and uh, we'll uh, see you guys uh, later.